Hey, oh shit. <laughs> what the fuck, nigga? You need me to leave you up here by yourself? No, no. No, I just want to address the troll. Like, don't this person January. I can say what the fuck I want to say about Chucky. Chucky talking about me, so I'm going to talk the fuck about him. But the only thing about Chucky, Chucky over here lying. So, Chucky, since you want to troll, bitch, let's troll. So, yes, Chucky sleeps on an air mattress. And if he lie about it, I'll put the tape out about that too, bitch. And you don't got no fucking furniture. And you live in a one-bedroom fucking apartment that you just moved the fuck in, nigga. Okay? And your bitch ass get SSI. That's why you ain't want to work. When I asked you, I said, Chucky, let me get you a fucking job. That's why your bitch ass ain't want to fucking work because you get SSI. And yes, Chucky worked for Mexicans and he cleaned up fucking warehouses and shit. So stop lying to motherfuckers talking about you went to Cali to visit your fucking family, bitch. You went to Cali to fucking clean out warehouses. You lying sack of shit. That's what the fuck your ass was doing in Beaumont and Louisiana too. Oh my. Cause you so fucking dumb. The motherfucking lady that you work for, nigga. Cause you say her um her motherfucking brother do the same work I do. And I found out who the fuck the fucking brother was, nigga. It ain't that hard to find. We IBO, so we know each other. That's how dumb you fucking is. So you tried to um snake me, tried to sign up with another motherfucker, and I know the motherfucker you signed up with, you dumb bitch. Yeah, he sleep on the air bed. He don't got no fucking furniture. He get SSI. That's why the bitch ass nigga don't wanna work. And the Mexican lady pay him under the table. She don't even pay that nigga. She had them niggas slaving. Chucky be working fucking like 12, 15 hours and don't even get no fucking money. She had y'all bitch ass working and slaving and shit for the little fucking pennies she get y'all. And there's a whole lot of Mexicans that work for her and she don't even pay them that fucking much. So all that you tell her, oh, you getting money, you getting money. Stop fucking lying. She pay y'all lower than minimum wage, bitch. So you don't how get no get fucking you? money. A joke, let me ask you a question. Good morning. Um, Good first morning. off, I'm, I'm sorry, get out of good, good morning, Ari. And it's morning. a tip agency. Yeah, it's a tip agency because he go up there all the time to see if the lady gonna give him work. So how does he so how did he get to LA? No, she she paid for the ticket. Oh she paid okay. for it and, and he go down there and he only was down there for two fucking days. And that and oh. that ticket comes out of his pay. He's so fucking lonely and desperate for a little bit of money that lady gonna give him. Um the plane ticket, all that shit come out of his pay. Cause she asked him, Do you wanna work locally or do you wanna go out? See the only reason why Chucky said he wanna go out because he wants y'all to think he's traveling and shit. So hold on. So you tell me that. So you telling us, not me, but you're telling us that his father doesn't own any type of oh, company. No, no. His mom and dad don't own shit. They sit home. His mom and dad, they elderly old people that sit home all fucking day. They don't do nothing. His dad don't work. He don't fuck. His dad don't work. The mother don't work. They sit home and collect disability. And it's wow. a different agency. Chucky go to every fucking day. It's ran by a Puerto Rican lady. He go there and ask her, do she got work? And she ain't been having no way. He, this is his first time working this whole fucking year. And he went to Cali for two fucking days. And lying, you're talking about you went up there. Bitch, you ain't got no family in Cali, bitch. Stop lying to people. You went down there, the, the fucking Mexican lady um, paid for your ticket, and you went down there. Stop fucking lying. Yeah, that's who he worked for. It's a tip agency. And the brother do the same work I do. The brother is the IBO. It's a tip agency Chucky go to every fucking day, begging them for work. And sometimes they tell him that they don't have no work for him. So he go take his raggedy ass back home, and they call him again the next day. Basically, he just be calling them every day until they got work for him. And they pay him under the table. But that's, how, that's how usually a temp agency works. Yeah, and he get SSI. That's how he pay his fucking rent. His whole SSI check go to his fucking rent. And the bitch don't be having food. See, nigga, I was trying to help you. I really ain't want to do this shit. I was trying to help you to get you back on your fucking feet, bitch. But no, you want to be a fucking troll. You want to listen to your fucking chat. So let's troll, nigga. Like, get the fuck out of here. I was trying to help you get you a fucking job. But I, now I know why you ain't want to fucking work. Because you ain't want your SSI check to get cut the fuck off. That's why you kept on asking me, what, um, do they give you a W-2? Or do you get like a 1099 form? That's why your bitch ass kept on asking me that shit. Because your bitch ass get SSI. And I got that proof too. Because I called the motherfucking, um, your motherfucking, the motherfucking leasing office where you live at. Keep on fucking playing with me, bitch. I drop everything going to give. The taste and everything. Up there lying, talking about you ain't on no fucking crack. The only reason why he lying to y'all saying he ain't on no crack because he don't actually smoke it out of a fucking pipe. He laced the shit in his fucking weed. So y'all won't know if he smoked that fucking weed he had when he was live showing his fucking face. That shit was laced up with crack. Okay, I got a question for you then. I got another question for you. So that day when he went live yeah. and he showed his face and everything, mm -hmm. um, was he going into some type of... Uh, some type of uh shock is that the reason yeah, why he, he no the reason why he went live because he seen betty had his name he seen betty because betty went live because i told his stupid i said chucky send a plane ticket to me by ig but no he he drunk it high off that shit so he he showed it on his live and he seen betty went live and betty had the whole name so i said well oh shit she got your name so what you gonna do that's why he camed up okay dog no, but what i'm asking you what i'm asking you is this um mm -hmm. when you ask him what did he have to eat he, he don't have, eat. He don't eat. He, he calls me, Mayor. This motherfucker calls me, beg me to send him money to get food. Chucky don't eat. Chucky, whatever little money Chucky get, he's been that shit on drugs. That's why the nigga's so skinny. Does he have diabetes? Yeah. That's why I be checking up on him all the time. Okay. That's the reason, why, yeah, that's that's the reason why we you. That's the reason why we was asking you, um, did, you know, the fact that you asked him, did he, what, um, what time did he eat? Because it, it, yeah. seemed like his blood sugar, it seemed like his blood sugar was going low. 
Yeah, cause that's why I, I, I keep checking on him and I say, Chucky, did you eat? Did you eat this? And he be lying, talking about, yeah, I ate, I ate. That nigga don't eat shit. And then he told me I was over there on Triple Panel talking about, nigga, you knew I was talking about you because you even told me you said lacquer black. This is how messy this fuck nigga is. He told me lacquer told him that I was talking about him. But he already knew, so he didn't give a fuck. We made up. But the bitch motherfucker mad because I ain't give him no fucking money. So after we made up, now if your fucking supporters give you fucking money, Chucky, why the fuck you tried to make up with me? But then in the same sense you making up, you asking me for money at the same time. But I thought you, I thought you had money. I thought you went to Cali and shit to visit your family though. But you asking me for money. The fuck out of here, yo. And no, Chucky don't got no fucking kids. The, the woman he was fucking around, he never been married. He don't got no kids. The woman he was fucking around with at the time, y'all heard the woman talking. That was Hold a girl. On. That was a woman he was fucking around with. That's not his fucking wife. She got kids. He don't got no kids. Hold on, time out, time out. Flag, flag on the plate, flag on the plate. Yeah. So you telling, so you, you telling us that um, Chucky has no kids at all? He don't got no kids. That's why he was so impressed the issue of me having his kids. He don't got none. And he never been married. I even looked that shit up. He never been married. That's why the nigga was asking me to marry him and had his fucking kids. So what, what, about, what about the day that he went to the uh, when he went to the zoo? Wasn't nobody. Wasn't no kids with him. He was there by himself. Ah. Okay. Yeah, he went to the zoo by himself. Wasn't no kids with him. Okay. That nigga lied so fucking. I got man, Chucky, e, go live, cause I'ma see what you do next. Yeah, since you wanna troll bitch, cause I already been you, you been was trying to dox me any fucking way. So let's get the doxing, bitch. I dox your fucking raggedy ass mom, your fucking daddy, all the motherfucker, your poor ass fucking family, bitch. You on here act like you got a, a fucking good family that got fucking money, bitch. I already got all your information, nigga. Your poor Please. ass fucking mama, your poor ass fucking daddy. That's the only motherfucking family you got in your fucking family, nigga. You ain't got nobody else. So fucking you see, a jokey, a jokey. You, you see why a lot of us, well, some of us have a problem with him as far as the um. The baby thing goes because he never like said, had a baby mayor. No, he never what, I'm had... is this. What, I'm, what, what I'm saying is this. You wasn't around when he had the um, when they, they had the famous um, his daughter was dying or his daughter needed uh, money for her um, her um, but insulin, yeah, for her insulin and for her medication. He said the medication was like 600 something dollars. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? He and don't then, got no daughter. The insulin was for him. He don't got then, no daughter. And then he had the um, then he had the famous Christmas show. You wasn't there for that either. The famous Christmas show yeah. said that this, this was going to be his daughter's last Christmas and um, they raised him um, damn it, two thousand dollars. But I guess what he really got his ass is when he said that um, he wanted his he daughter. He lied about that. Yeah, he I lied about that because um, this past Christmas, we was talking behind the scenes. He was about to do it again. I said, well, Chucky, I said, if you do it again, I said, motherfuckers ain't going to believe what you did last time. He was about to do that scam again. Act like, oh, you know, donate them for fucking Christmas and all that shit. Like, nigga, get the fuck out of here. Just like you did that fucking little, that little drive for my birthday. I ain't getting none of that money. He got all that fucking money. I told him, don't do it. But hold he on, did hold, it. Hold on, hold yes, on, hold the money hold motherfuckers hold was donating him for my birthday, he kept all that money. You bullshit. Yes. That motherfucker so, got over seven hundred dollars. He kept every last one. Of them. I said, Chucky, don't do. It. I said, they ain't gonna donate to you. He said, No, nah, babe, they gonna donate. Watch this. So what about the trip to um? So hold on. So what about what about all these trips that he said he went to? Uh, he came to Philly. When he first came to Philly, he was trolling. He was in he was in Jersey. I was asking him what was his room number. Now let's get down to this catfish and shit. He claimed I catfished him. I never catfished Chucky. Chucky catfished me. When we first started talking, he lied and said he was he was um he used to be in the military. He got muscles and all that shit. He work out and he you know he he eat healthy and all this shit. So I'm like okay, you know I want to see what it is. Motherfucker was lying from the rip. I never catfished him. That's why when he came to Philly the first time, he ain't want to meet up because how he looked. Well, you know you, you know just put in he's about to start with live up in thirty minutes. So I don't give a fuck <laughs> if he starts. I want him to so I can expose this bitch more. I want him to start. Let's let's go, Chucky. Let's go. Cause you said get a lot of hey, motherfucking body. So I'm I fucked the white dude and I smoke crack. Let's go, bitch. So I can play these fucking records of you copping fucking drugs from the nigga in the fucking in the fucking um the dope dealer. Even called you a dope fiend. Say what your dope fiend ass want? You owe me two dollars. Okay, I got a question for you. I, let me, I got a question. Even, even though even though it's old and it's, it's been almost a year, let me ask you something, uh, Majoki. Mm -hmm. When, when uh, Chucky got to me, did you know about him? Did you know him about um, him about to put my name out here when he did that uh, late night? I didn't know he was about to do that. I even asked him why he do that. I ain't know. Okay. And when you asked him, what did he say? He didn't say nothing. He was like, oh, fuck him. I said, why you do that? Okay. Yeah. All right. That's all I want to know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, that. like, Chucky, let's go. You want to troll? Let's, let's get it popping. That's why your bitch has been holding back because you know I got a lot of shit on you. You ear bed sleeping bitch. You ain't even got no furniture in your fucking apartment. And you don't got no fucking dishes and plates and shit. You don't even buy food for your fucking self. You call me every time when your bitch ass hungry. Oh, baby, buy me something to eat. Get the fuck out of here. I ain't taking no fucking grown ass fucking man, bitch. So, That's all the fuck you want is money, money, money. So your bitch ass can get high. So um, let me ask you something else. This whole thing with um, with Boston Strong. He he be threatening Boston Strong. And Boston Strong, if you listening, get the fuck away from Chucky. That man gonna fucking fucking just dry you the fuck out of money. That man Chucky be fucking threatening him. Now the same shit that we were saying that um ZX did to um fucking Boston. Chucky do that shit to Boston every day. Threatening Boston, telling Boston if you don't send me money, I'm gonna expose you and oh, all this shit. Well, he does it to everybody. He says I'm exposing you for the bitch nigga that you are. He no, but everybody. actually Boston is actually scared. 
I don't know what the fuck boss, whatever boss got his criminal background or whatever, Boston is actually scared. That's why Boston be giving Chucky three hundred dollars, you know, four hundred dollars here. So that money that um that money that Boston Strong um cashed at me that one time. Why did Chucky get so angry over the money that he cashed at? Because he jealous and he ain't want Boston. He don't want nobody over there donating to me. One time, motherfucker was donating to me. He just nigga got jealous and called me, cussed me out early in the morning, telling me to send him half of the money. After Boston already gave him six hundred dollars, this nigga smoked up the six hundred dollars in one fucking day and then called me in the morning, calling me all kind of bitches, telling me I better send him half of the three hundred. Mm. Fuck out of here! I ain't supporting your fucking drug habit. I gave this nigga a whole stack, mayor, and told him to go buy some underwear and shit. You know some underwear deodorants and all that shit. The bitch ass motherfucker ain't never buy it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You gave you, you gave you gave this nigga a stack. Yes, it told him to go buy him some t-shirts. Hold on, you told this nigga to, you gave this nigga a stack. Yeah. To go, to, to go buy him some drawers and some t-shirts, basically yeah. some everyday with some some everyday uh mm -hmm. personal accoutrements. Yeah. Okay. Wow. And he never did. Motherfucker smoked the money up. The only thing he bought was a new laptop, another laptop, and the motherfucker the Jordans. That's it. All the rest okay. of the money, he he fucked that up. Okay, I, I got another question. Another question I have is this: Why did he um? This, this is what I don't understand. He had a um interview talking about what ZX did to Miss Fifi, right? He don't care why about he, that. He thought it was a money grab. That's why and, he and went why, live. And you see that shit didn't work out for him. And, and, but did you see what he did for today, right? I know. He don't care about that lady. He thought it was a money grab. That's why he went live. He thought he was going to get a couple donations off of it. And But he see that shit ain't working now. He won't go live about me in the morning. Nigga, I don't give a fuck. Chucky, go live again so I can expose your bitch ass some more. Okay. Okay. I don't care. I'm tired of no. I'm tired of still getting taken up for him. Fucking covering yeah, up for this fucking broke ass, dope fiend okay, ass nigga. So now you, so now you know how I felt about me taking up for him, and um, you know, because he said he was a marine. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, yeah. And um, and come to find out that this man has stolen valor. Yeah, he never was in the marine. Okay. I even asked because he told me when I first started talking to him, he was in the military. You know, he said he worked out, he got a nice body, all this shit. He told me mm -hmm. he was 36 years old. No, he yeah. can't be 36. He yes, can't be 36. mayor, this motherfucker told me he was 36. Okay, okay, I got another question. Um, the buddy pull up. The buddy Lee pull up. What was what, what was up with that? Oh, he um when he pulled well, I don't know if that's buddy where buddy lived at or not when they did the pull up with each other. I wasn't with Chucky then. Okay. Yeah. But okay, all right. But he did tell me he had buddy address. He said I got buddy information, you know, and all that. But let me let me just say this. I know where Chucky live at. Don't nobody know. See, everybody think of Chucky live in Garden City projects. He don't live there. I know exactly where this motherfucker live at. And I know mm -hmm. his fucking mother live at too. Well, we're not gonna say. Well, that's one thing. We're not. We're not gonna. We're not gonna talk. We don't need the parents out of this. We don't need the parents out of this. This is between. Uh, this is between you and uh, him. And um, but I seen. The, I seen the interview. Well, I seen the interview that you had with uh, Triple. Yeah. What was up with that? No, I was talking to the um the, uh, the troll in there. Her name Jackie. So she was asking me stuff. So I said mm -hmm. I was telling her what it was when I when I came over there to Chucky. All that you know, couple shit, marriage shit. That shit came from me. All that content Chucky was doing, hooking up motherfuckers. That shit came from me. Chucky ain't know what the fuck to talk about over there. Okay. This is one. This is probably one of the biggest questions that everybody probably wants to know of. What was the deal with the back chat? Okay, now back Chucky chat? back chat. Okay, so Chucky got a back chat. He got a couple of people in it. I told him to be out. And Chucky back chat. The same thing that said showed Chucky begging motherfuckers for money. Yes, that's what Chucky do. Chucky be in his back chat, begging motherfuckers for money, telling people order to get in his back chat. You gotta pay him. He told Boston Strong. Now this is a regular person that donated to him all the time. He told Boston Strong, oh, for you to join my back chat, you gotta give me five hundred dollars. And, and, and please don't tell me that um, Boston Strong gave him $500. I don't know. I don't know if Boston Strong gave him $500. But the same shit, just like when he had True Seeker back there, but he know True Seeker ain't dumb. You're not going to play him and keep on asking him for money. He used to do the same shit to True Seeker. Keep on hitting True Seeker up, telling True Seeker to donate to him. Donate to him. But see, True Seeker like, no, I, I'm not giving you nothing. He do the same shit to me. Send, send me money. Send me money. Everybody, he do the same shit to everybody. It's certain people he do it to. He don't do it to everybody. But certain but, motherfuckers he do it to, he'll keep on asking you for money every day. Right. Well, you know what? See, th th see, this is the problem right now because, see, I think what the problem is is this: you tell us one thing, he says another, and then the next thing you know, both of no, y'all back together. No, 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 he gonna go live again. May you trust me? All this shit gonna come out. I'm, I'm gonna see what's, what's his next move. C go live, Chucky. Go live. Dox me. Show my real picture. You lied about that. Now that picture of the dark skin girl that, that um that that's floating around. That's my home girl. Chucky put that picture out on his IG. I called Chucky. I said, Chucky, take my friend's picture down. Now, whoever um. Put that as their avatar, ZX got a hold of it. And so ZX knew that was a beast, but ZX trolled it too. So he went around saying, oh yeah, that's a jokey. Chucky lying in there going to agree with ZX. And I even told, I said, why would you agree with him? You know that's not me. Okay, I got another question for you. Why didn't you get in Chucky's ass when he put my ex-wife picture up? I didn't know that was your ex-wife at first until you came on the panel and said it. And I did tell Chucky. I said, Chucky, why would you do that? I said, that's wrong. Why would you put that man family up? Chucky was sending me motherfucking pictures of your brother. He was him and, Yeah, him and some, some troll ass nigga. He got his back chat named Trey. Okay, I know you. I know you talking about as far as Trey. I, I yeah. know Trey. I, I know who Trey is. I, I've heard. I've heard of him and I've seen him. So him and Trey was um. Yeah, they the one that was putting out your um the pictures of your brother, your your ex wife and all that. Yeah, that was them. Them too. 
Okay, did he put the um did he have any privy to having pictures of my daughter? I don't know about that. They never um I know Trey and him sent me a picture of your brother and your wife. Uh, he, they never sent me a picture of your daughter, but Chucky did say they had pictures of your daughter. Oh, so he had also oh, he yeah, got, they got yeah, they got they got pictures. Trey is a troll. He he look up people info for Chucky. He fucking mm -hmm. search for people on Facebook for Chucky. Everything. That motherfucker, he's like if that's the person that Chucky goes to to find people. Okay, so you're telling me. And, and, and please and please and please don't lie yes, to me. Yes, he said he got yeah, he said he got he pictures got, of your daughter, yes. He got pictures of my daughter. Yes, he said he got pictures of your whole family. Okay, Chucky, I know you listening. Yeah, Chucky Bitch told me that. He just he never showed me a picture of your daughter. But yeah, he said he oh. got pictures of your whole family. Okay, Chucky, it's on now, player. It's, yeah. it's, motherfuck it's, it's motherfucking on now, nigga. I'm, nigga, you, you on my nigga, you on my hit list, nigga. You definitely on my hit list. I told you, bro, don't fuck with my family. If you wanna fuck with me, fuck with me. But it's on and popping. I'm telling you right now, Chucky, don't bring your ass to Detroit. You better you better not bring your Yeah, Chucky's sick. Like he do a lot of he do a lot you of fuck shit not. behind the scenes. Right, right. I'm telling you right now, Chucky, do not bring your black ass to Detroit. You have a no fly zone. You have a no fly zone in Detroit. And the jokey, I'm telling you right now, if you go back to his ass, I'm not going back. I ain't been back over there. I ain't been back with him. And he know that I don't like the shit he do. And I even told him, I said, Chucky, why you doing all this shit? I ain't, I ain't actually been back with him. Yeah, yes, I said, when you come to Philly, the nigga scared he ain't gonna come to Philly. That's why I told him, I said, come to my house. Now, if a motherfucker want to give you an invitation to come to their house and you don't want to come, he don't want to come because he's scared of ZX. That's the real reason. He said, oh, I'm not going to your house, you know, ZX, because ZX live close to me. That's the real reason why he don't want to come. Keep it real, Chucky. Stop, stop sitting up here on a panel with ZX acting like you do tough and shit with him. The real reason why Chucky don't want to come to my house because he's scared of ZX. And he thinking ZX going to pull up and fucking knock on my door. That's the real reason. Stop trying to act like you tough up there. And that, that is the reason why he went to Maxi's in the morning. Because the bitch ass nigga was scared. Nigga, ZX was going to pull up on him when ZX told him to come at nighttime. Like, keep it real. Stop trying to act like you tough. You just got beat the fuck up last month, nigga. Two niggas in Texas beat his ass up and robbed him and took his phone. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So, that um, that that um, fight that he got in. Yes. Uh, he, the, um, the fight that he came from myself. Oh, he almost broke his hand. Yeah. That's, that's two night men night. robbed him. Took it. Took okay. his phone. That was the two men that when um, Dyer said she sent the fifty dollars back. Mm -hmm. That was that. Whoever had his phone is the one that was requesting money from people. Yeah, they beat Chucky the fuck up. Robbed him. Busted his um, car window out and everything. And he went live acting like he beat them up. The motherfucker was on the phone with me, breathing real fucking hard, telling me to call him. Call him. Two motherfuckers just robbed him and shit. They robbed that bitch and beat his ass. Okay. Hey, Chucky, don't play with me. When you go cop drugs, you the motherfucking drug nigga be putting pointing guns at your bitch ass. They be saying, "Oh, bitch, you owe me money and all this shit." He be owing the fucking so. yes. He owe, so he owe, he owe the dope man. Yes. When Chucky go with me, Chucky be on the phone and he be talking to the drug the um dope motherfucking dealer. They be like, "Oh, what your dope fiend want? You owe me five dollars any fucking way." Yeah, he be owing the motherfuckers money. So, Jokey, um, when when did you when, when did you um decide to say that? Enough is enough is enough, and, and I'm he done. He lied to everybody, telling myself, "Oh, I, no! I, first of all, I really been was done with Chucky. Yeah, I be over there, I had my little fun, but I been was done with him when he fucking made that intervention about me. I was just waiting for the next time he gonna fuck up. But now he talking about, oh, I smoke crack too, nigga. I ain't never smoked crack a day in my fucking life, bitch. I even told you when, if you came to Philly, I was gonna serve you. I told him that I said, I said, Chucky, I know what you do. I, don't, I told him I said, I don't care. That's your business. I said, when you come to Philly, you know I'll hook you up, and that's between me and you. He was down so, with the shit. So you gonna you, you gonna serve him up? To I the was going had that nigga smoked out, mayor, and he was down with it. He even told me, he said, oh, well, when I come, come to the hotel room, bring the, bring the weed, the wet, everything. Say I'm lying, Chucky. Hold on, hold on. So, so hold on. You telling us that um, Chucky smokes wet? Yes. He smoked crack. He laced his weed with crack. He laced it with wet, all that shit. Say I'm lying, Chucky, and I'll play these motherfucking tapes, bitch. You telling me when you come to Philly, he, he told me, oh, come to the hotel, bring the weed, the wet, the crack, everything, and the liquor and shit. Say I'm lying, you old bitch. So um, how old how old is Chucky? Anyway, Chucky, Chucky about fifty years old. You you come on, yes. quit bullshit. Chucky is fifty. Bull yes, he's up there with ZX and you. Well, I, I don't have no problem saying my age. I'm fifty one. I have no problem with that. So you tell yeah. us that Chucky, you tell us that um Chucky is in his is um yes yes that that, that 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 um that that um background check ZX that's not Chucky. That's another Chucky. That that's not him ZX. That 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 background you pulled up that ain't him. I got okay. the real fucking background on Chucky. Chucky is fifty. So Chucky's part of the AARP club like yes. you know, ZX, huh? Yeah, he's 50, he a diabetic, he all crack, and he get SSI. Shout out to the AARP club, you know? Oh, okay. Dang. Yeah, so uh, that background, that's not Chucky real birthday, the one that ZX had. I got Chucky oh, real birthday. Oh, you talking about the one that says uh, 78 or something like that? Yeah, that ain't that ain't Chucky. That's why I said Chucky, take you, because I'm tired of him any motherfucker way. So let's start exposing each other, Chucky. You ain't got shit on me. Only that you guys my pictures, nigga. You ain't got nothing on me. So let's start exposing Chucky. Go live, put my name in the title again, and start talking shit about me. And watch me hit somebody's panel with the fucking um the fucking records of you. Uh, go live, bitch. I want you to. Keep on going live, trying to listen to your fucking chat and shit. Your chat don't even give a fuck about you, nigga. When you cammed up, everybody was laughing at your ugly ass. You nasty looking bitch. Nigga, you gonna fuck somebody. So 
was that the first time you ever seen him when he cammed up like that? I've been seeing him. I've been seeing Chuck. I just ain't never okay. say nothing. Okay, so um, another question is: all these um pictures that um are going out on YouTube that um that they're saying they're you are any of these pictures true? No, none are of them these, is are, me. None of those pictures are you. Mm -mm. Okay. Chucky know that. ZX know that too. Chucky know ain't none of them pictures me. He up here talking about oh she a catfish. Bitch, I ain't never catfish you. The fuck I look like cat catfishing you out of all people, Chucky. You ain't got shit. You ain't nothing. You don't got nothing. What the fuck I look like catfishing you? You can't even pay your own electric and shit. Yeah, tell what everybody you, that. How you can't even you, pay your electric bill, your phone bill, or your fucking um your um stream yard bill. You broke ass nigga. Well, we all know that um you know, we, we all know that he had that when he asked you that day, he had his um he almost went to that diabetic shock. And like I said, and, and I'm not I'm not dogging the brother. But well, well, we all know the brother needs help. But you know, like I said, he's on my shit list now. But all I'm saying is this. We all know that um he need help paying his boost mobile bill. Yeah, he asked me to pay his fucking bills. Right, we heard that. We heard Sometimes that. Sometimes he don't even have he get his motherfucking SSI check and spends half of it and not even keep up on that too. I said, Chucky, did you pay your rent? I keep up on his bill. I said, Chucky, did you pay your rent? Did you pay your light bill? He'll sit there and say, Oh yeah, I paid it. But then a week later, oh well, shit, my my light bill do, baby. Oh, I'm 200 behind on rent and shit like that. Nigga, please. Okay. And his fucking mama is his payee. Wow. Okay, so I, I got two questions for you. Um, one, are you light skinned? Yeah. Okay. Number two, why did you lie so much for him? Because I was trying to protect him. I'm like, okay, we talking. You know, I loved him. I didn't care about how he looked. I'm like, okay, I'm looking at Chucky like, okay, this a man. You know, I loved him. I was trying to protect him. That's why so I was lying actually, so much for him. So, so you actually, so you actually genuinely care for this Yeah, man. I cared about him. Yes, I was trying to help him in his life. Okay. I even told so, him I was going to move him to a different place where he lived at. It, uh, Chucky, don't get me started, nigga. Do not get me started on how your fucking place look. So, um, I, um, there was one live he had. He was in like in a, um, he said that he was in his living room and it had a pool table in there or something like that. Um, I don't know. Do you remember that? I'm gonna say like he don't got no pool table. Chucky don't got no furniture. Yeah, he don't <laughs> got no furniture. He got an air mattress he sleep on in his room. He got a one bedroom apartment. He got an air mattress and that's it. And he got an air mattress. I think he got like a couple of spoons and forks, two plates, like two pots and shit. And the microwave. Actually, he don't even got a microwave no more because the microwave he bought, it broke the fuck down. So, yeah, he ain't got shit. He don't got no furniture. Wow. Yeah, he don't got nothing. That's why when he, when he can't double show his perfume and shit. Right. Who you think got the perfume for him? You mean the cologne? Yeah, well, whatever the fuck he had, the Issy yeah. Miyagi. Who you yeah. think got that for him? Me. He ain't had none of that shit. Right, right. I got and one picture. Out of all the pictures, I, I dressed up. I dressed Chucky up one time. You know, bought him a new shirt, new jeans, all that shit. Got him a haircut. Since since the, the last time I got him a haircut, Chucky ain't had no haircut <laughs> shit. That's why when the bitch had motherfucker cams up, you see his head was peaked. Right. He said he had that he, he said he had that good wavy. Lying. He a lying ass motherfucker. I got his haircut one time and he looked at real nice. Haircut everything. After so, that, he ain't getting no more haircut because the bitch, he don't he don't think about that. He think about getting high. So um, uh, how long has he had this apartment? Oh, they moved him. Okay, so the apartment that he's in, he he been in that apartment complex for, for a minute. They just mm -hmm. moved him to a different unit. Did he live in a group home? No. He never lived in a group home. Okay. Mm -mm. Okay. Well, um, so I have a problem with um, like I say, the, the cologne that you bought him, right? You know, I'm, I'm a cologne connoisseur. Yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? And um, the cologne he had, you know, uh, it's it's all right. I, yeah, I, I don't. Yeah, that, that cologne, motherfuckers down here don't wear no shit like that. But yeah, that's what he wanted. So I got it for him. He, he wanted the cologne. He wanted the sneakers. I got. It. He wanted the jeans, the shirt. I got all that for him. Like, okay. I even gave Chucky money to get his fucking raggedy ass fucking pickup truck fixed. Okay, that's what we want to talk about. Let's talk about the pickup truck. Is it a yeah. pickup truck or is it a truck or is it like a, um, like an SUV? No, it's a pickup truck. You know, you can put stuff in the back of it. Yeah. Okay, all right. So yeah, it's an old pickup truck too. The bitch always breaking the fuck down. He always called me telling, oh, I need this, I need that. Old ass pickup truck ass shit. I even told him I'll go get him a new car. He can't get the fucking car because I can get it. I already put my information, but I gotta be in Texas to get it. I told him, I said, okay, Chucky, I got the money. Go put your, go show your proof that the nigga lied and said, you, I said, Chucky, do you make over, you know, 1300 a month? He said, yeah. I said, okay. I, I even called the dealership, everything. The nigga was waiting for Chucky. I said, Chucky, go take the information down there. I'm going to give you the down payment. You're going to get the car. Motherfucker right. never went because he don't make that much. He don't make over 1300 a month. So did he want, so were you going to buy him this um, BMW that he was going to No, it wasn't a BMW, but it was a nice car. He wanted to, um, it was, a, um, I think it was like an F-150, like one of the newest ones. And I was yeah. going to get it for him. But okay. he don't got the income. The guy said, only thing he got to do is make over 1300 It was it, the guy wasn't going to do no credit check on him or nothing. Okay, I'm so, going to uh, put the money down. I'm going to put about, about three three stacks down. And okay, the guy hold on, said, hold on, go ahead. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Jackie. I didn't mean to interrupt you. But the thing about it is this. Basically, you was co-signed for him, right? Yeah. So if you see that he's irresponsible with money, why would you put yourself in that predicament to co-sign for him when, um, you know, nine times out, nine times out of ten, um, he was going to have No, man, the car, I was going to pay for that. I was going to pay monthly on that. He, oh, I, yeah, he, okay. I, all, all he did, he had to do because the car was going to be his name. 
And I said, Chucky, she already put put my application in. I got approved. But the guy said, I need to be in Texas. I, I have to be a resident of Texas right, and right, I have to be in here and with a Texas ID. So I said, Chucky, I said, well, I told you, I said, well, it's really not for me. It's for my boyfriend. I said, mm -hmm. so he said, okay. He said, long as he make over $1,300 a month, you know, he said he don't do no credit check, none of that. Long as he can bring in some pay stuff saying that he make over 1300 And I said, he said, well, how much you trying to put down? I said, well, how much can I put down so he can get the car? The guy said, okay, bring 3000 I said, okay. So I told this, Chucky, this, wasn't a, this wasn't this wasn't a um what you call like a major dealership. This was like no, it was like um, a buy here, pay here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. Um, another question that we have is on your birthday, mm -hmm. and when he went silent and he came back, mm -hmm. did his uncle did his uncle really no, die? No. No. Nope. Because matter of fact, right after that, after he said his uncle died, a couple days later, the motherfucker said it the, the same lie he said online. He said the same lie to me on the phone. I said, "Well, Chucky," I said, "Well, then your uncle just passed away, you know, last week." I said, "Why are you telling me he passed away again this week?" Yeah, he don't even he, he can't even catch up with his fucking life. Hold on, hold on. So his uncle, so the same uncle in California passed away again this week. Twice, yes, mayor, yeah, twice. <laughs> this motherfucker can't even catch, he can't even remember the lies he fucking made. And then he got mad at me cussing me out. I said, "Well, Chucky, you just went live and said your uncle passed away." I said, "So why the fuck?" And then he told himself, "Oh, baby, guess what?" I said, "What?" Oh, my uncle just passed away in Cali. I said, "When?" He said, "He just passed away today." I said, "Chucky, you just said the uncle passed away last week." So what the fuck? That's how much he lied because he was trying to get money out of me. Talk about he got to buy a plane ticket and all this shit. Tell himself, "Oh, you gonna help me with the plane ticket?" I said, "Yeah, if the motherfucker really passed away." That's why I even told her, I said, I'll go with you. The next day, okay. no, the Cali trip is over. Like, I told him I was going to go with you. Okay, another question. Why does, why, why does it seem like every time that y'all plan on seeing one another, and I, and I think that the, uh, the chat room can um, attest to that, why is it that every time that y'all two are about to meet with one another, y'all always get into it? Y'all always get into him. it. If Mayor, now if I'm telling him, like, okay, when he first came down here, I said, Chucky, because this is when it was going to be a double date. This is when, you know, I was cool with Shakima, you know, Trucy, we always going to meet up. Okay. He need the one backed out. And then I said, well, Chucky, what? I said, what hotel you at? What's the room? I'm going to come through. Motherfucker never gave me the room number, nothing. No, I well, ain't you, know what hotel he was in, none of that. Well, you do have, you do realize that this much is this. Um, if you two have never seen one another, and um, the fact that you saw him, but he's never seen you, wouldn't you be a little bit apprehensive and giving somebody your room number? Mayor, that day, uh, Mayor, that day, I even, it was our first time we were going to see each other. I said, Chucky, I said, when you get to Philly, I said, give me your room number and the whole time I'm going to come through. I said, actually, we could go live on IG. You can see me. I can see you and you will see me coming to you. That mm -hmm. was the very first time we was going to cam up with each other. I called this motherfucker on IG like he never was picking up. Never. So, that day, okay, so, um, were you telling the truth when you said you came down to uh, Houston and you said you had family down there? When you yes, said you the motherfucker airport? never came at the airport, Mayor. So never you, you, came. So, you actually telling us that you did come to Houston. Yes, I you, yes. I told him, I told Chuck, I said, Chucky, I said, when I get off the airport, I'm going to call you, come pick me up. This motherfucker was on a live talking to y'all. I'm calling his phone back to back, back to back, back to back, sending him a message. He online lying to y'all saying I ain't trying to come see him. Okay, well, this, this is what I, now this is what I have a problem with. The problem I have with is this. If you was flying from Philly to Houston, why didn't you give him the um, name of the airlines and your flight number? I did. That's why I told him to come up with me. I did. He knew everything. So he knew your flight number and he knew, yes, he knew your I flight said, number. Chucky, and... Yes, I said, Chucky, I said, when I get off, I said, you better be at the airport. I even got the text message. I said, Chuck, you better be at the airport. He said, I'm going to be there. I said, okay. I said, I'm going to call you when I get off. He said, okay. He knew. We was uh, we was online checking the flights together. Okay. That's why I said he's a fucking liar. Because then I asked, I said, Chuck, I said, why you so scared? I said, I'm here. Why you, you know, why you scared to meet up? I said, won't you? I said, matter of fact, um, send me a picture of how you look right now. I told him. He was hesitating about sending me. He ain't want to send me shit. I said, Chucky, send me a picture of how you look right now because I wanted to know why he was so scared to meet up. So he sends me a picture of him in the car. He bony did a motherfucker. Cheeks sucked in everything. So I ain't really saying that. I'm looking like, damn, so this is the real reason why you don't want to come see nobody. I mean, mm -hmm. look strong out. Cheeks sucked in. The only fucking reason why Chucky looked like he got a little weight on him when he came up is because I've been feeding that bitch. Okay, so, um, and I, and what airport did you fly into? Did you fly into, um, the, uh, which, which airport did you fly? You, you flew in the hobby. Yeah, he knew everything, man. The motherfucker was lying the whole time. And then late, it got real late at night. I was on my cousin's house. Real late at night. He won't call talking about where you at. I said, Chucky, stop playing these fucking games with me. Oh, I'm going to come to you. I said, Chucky, stop lying. And then I told him, I said, okay, I said, I said, meet me at the airport again. I said, when you get to the airport, let me know. Motherfucker lying, talking about he in traffic and all this dumb shit. I said, Chucky, you know what? Just stay where the fuck you at. I'm not with the game. Because my cousin even was saying he playing fucking games. But he come online to y'all and lie to y'all and say, oh, she ain't trying to meet up. When well, he came to Philly the last time, I said, Chucky, I said, either I come pick you up. I asked him. I said, Chucky, you want me to come pick you up? I said, I'll either come pick you up or if you don't want me to. I said, if you feel, feel as though, if you know, you think a motherfucker trying to set you up. I said, you come to my house. Knock on my door. The motherfucker came, never knocked on the door. Never. And then, then when he was live, I, I hopped on his motherfucking um, live. I said, Chucky, you want me to come see you? He said, yeah. I said, all right, after this live, call me. 
I'm texting. I said, Chucky, what's the hotel you in? What's the room number? He said he was at the Double Tree. Come to find out, he's so fucking dumb. My cousin worked at the Double Tree at the time. He was motherfucking work at the time. He was um claiming he was coming. The nigga was not at the Double Tree. He was lying the whole time. So he wasn't. He, he wasn't on, at the Double Tree on no. the main floor. No. Nope. In, the, in the corner room with the. No. Nope. No, nope, Mayor. Never. He never was at the Double Tree. He was lying that whole fucking time. Okay. That's why I no. said the motherfucker lied so much. And I even tested him on it. I said, Chucky, I said, tell me the truth. Was you at the double tree? He said, yeah. I said, so if I show proof you wasn't there, and, you know, I had my cousin pull the tape, and you wasn't never in the lobby or nothing, he, he got mad at me. This was the other day. He got so mad. This, like, so this is the same. So is this the same? Your cousin works at the same double tree? Yes. And what he says that he works at? I mean, and what yeah, he, he, that he went to? Yes. And I even I even um told him about that shit two days. I said, Chucky, was you at that double tree? He said, yeah, I was there. I said, well, show, I said, show your receipt and shit. Never, motherfucker never showed me shit. I said, so Chucky, I said, so if I expose you and, and show you proof that you wasn't there, he said, oh, Chucky, I don't give a fuck. I was there. How the fuck you gonna show me? I said, Chucky, I said, my cousin worked at the double tree. I said, around the time you said you was coming, I said, my cousin, that was her shift. So if you were there, she would have saw you. She worked at the front desk. She the first person you see. So I said, so she pulled a tape that you wasn't there. Oh, well, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. I was there, and so what? Just like when he said he was in Philly. Chucky showed me, when he told me he was on his way to Philly, he showed me a plane ticket saying from Houston to Florida. He never showed me a ticket saying he was from, um, from, um, from Houston to Philly. He showed a plane ticket saying from Houston to Orlando, Florida. Okay, so um, an another question we have. The video that he showed that said, welcome to Philadelphia. Was he really in Philadelphia when he showed that video? I don't know. That's why but I was telling were... him to give me the room number. He never gave it to me, so I'm, I'm just like you. I'm like, oh, this nigga lying. But you, you, but you know what I'm talking about. You seen the video? Yeah, I seen it. Yeah. That said, welcome, that said, welcome to Philadelphia, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, he never showed me. I even told him, mate. I said, okay. I, when he said he was at the dumpster, I said, Chucky. I said, make a little video. Are you in the hotel room? I said, if you, I said, if you make a little video. Are you in the hotel room? I will come to the double tree. Motherfucker never made it. Never sent me shit. I mean, because y'all could admit. I mean, if, if this is y'all first time meeting, you gotta realize if this is my first time meeting you, I'm not giving you my room. I'm mean, talking. He never said meet in the lobby or nothing. Never, Mayor. He wasn't at the double tree. He lied. But you can understand. But you can understand my concerns. Yeah, yeah. yeah I okay. can understand that. Right. I even told him. I said, Chucky. I said, Well, let's meet up somewhere. I, you know, it, it ain't had to be at the double tree. We could have met downtown 15th and Market anywhere. Motherfucker right. never met up. Never gave me no kind of information. None of that shit. So some of the places you were saying to meet up, they wasn't in like in um in the hood spots. Like no, they like downtown. You know, out in the open. Okay, so nothing like this. Uh, what was that? What you say? K, K and Nathan, you know, yeah, all that. Yeah, K and A's on the opening, but that's the hood. But you know, that's the hood, right? That's the hood. Where his cop said, you know, meet downtown 15th for market. You know, he said me that he said, you know, he was at the double. I said, okay. I said, let's, you know, what's your room number? How you want to meet? Motherfucker never said meet me in the lobby. He never gave me the room number. He started giving out room numbers after his ass got back to Houston. So, um, Maxie's is Maxie's in the hood? Yeah, it's on Germantown area. Okay, so Germantown, so Germantown is considered the hood. It's considered the hood. Yeah, uh, it's in North Philly. Yeah, it's the hood. I mean, but people go there when they travel to Philly because they, you know, they want to go to Maxie's. But you know, Maxie's they got um police cameras and shit. But you can still get away with shit. It's still you know motherfuckers still pop off shit on that corner. That's why he went to Maxie's in the morning. He didn't go to Maxie's at night when ZX did. Ain't nobody eat no fucking cheesesteak early in the fucking morning. Cause I even asked him that. I said, nigga, your motherfucking stomach gonna be fucked up. You eating and drinking early in the fucking morning. This motherfucker came all the way from Jersey to go to Maxie's just to prove that he could go to Maxie's to ZX. But he went in the morning time. Ain't nobody gonna do nothing to you in the morning time. So do you really think that um, ZX would put hands on Chucky Beaver's song? No, ZX ain't gonna do nothing, but somebody would put hands on him. I even told him that. I said, Chucky, I see you playing around. I said, you're not from Philly. I said, you don't know how Philly niggas is. I even told him, I said, ZX ain't gonna touch you. I said, but he gonna stand there while niggas touch you. And ain't nobody gonna do shit. I said, ain't nobody gonna do shit if he, if he touch you on the corner of Mexico. They just gonna let him touch you. I told him that. But he, you know, he wanna act tough for YouTube and shit like that. And I told him, I said, leave ZX alone. I told him, I said, leave ZX alone because you said you talking shit and you okay. know, you come to Maxi's and if he see you there, you gonna get okay. touched. Okay. Um, so this is, okay. This is another question. When he put, when he said he came to the, um, when he said he came to the double tree where your cousin worked at. Yeah. Wouldn't it have been easy for your cousin to pull up his name in the registry? Yes. He been? wasn't there. Mayor, that's what I'm trying to tell you. He lied. He oh, never so went to the double tree. Okay. So he wasn't on, he wasn't on the registry. No, he never was there. Okay. The motherfucker probably was in Jersey again somewhere. One of them cheap ass hotels. You know, Jersey got a hotel for like fifty dollars, sixty. How Chucky ain't staying in no double tree. Double tree room for a day it depends on what type of room you get. They run from like one fifty, two hundred. That motherfucker ain't spend no one fifty to two hundred dollars no fuck for one day. Okay. That motherfucker was at Jersey at one of them rinky dink ass hotels over there in Cherry Hill, paying probably like sixty five dollars for a day. That's where he was at. That's why he didn't give me his room number or tell me to meet him in no lobby or anything that day when he went live. He wasn't at no double tree. Trust me, the way how Chucky show off, Double Tree the rooms is nice. That's you know that's where motherfuckers oh, yeah, got a little yeah, couple dollars. Yeah. Yeah, if he was yeah, if he was at the double tree, he would have showed y'all his fucking room. Yeah, you you read you, you read about that. You read about the, the double tree does have some nice um. Yeah, he would have nice showed y'all his room. Right. And, and, and um, even if he was at the double tree, 
that's still in Philly, Chucky. You first of all, when he know he got a little downtown Philly, yeah, that's downtown. downtown. Yeah. So oh, yeah, anything downtown, any, any um major city that you go to, be up downtown. But even this the thing, mayor. Even when, if he was at the Double Tree, ZX mm -hmm. still would have touched him. ZX would have went in the Double Tree. You can the motherfucker don't give a fuck. You can go in the Double Tree, ZX slide somebody a couple dollars, and we went up to that nigga room and touched them there. That's why I said Chucky wasn't ever at the Double Tree. It don't matter what hotel you live you, that you in in Philly. If a nigga want you, they gonna get you. Okay. Chucky know that shit. That's why his ass be over there in Jersey and New York. So, um, when him and True Seeker, when him and True Seeker are together, with um, was True Seeker, you know, front him as far as um, buying them items such as gym shoes and things like that. No, True Seeker did give him money to buy some sneakers, you know. Okay. But he ain't even gonna meet up with because of how the fuck he looked. True Seeker had Hennessy, we we all gonna meet up. True Seeker had the Airbnb ready, you know, mm -hmm. for everybody. Cause True Seeker, you know, he owned properties and shit. So right. you know, he had the weed, the bear. You know, it was gonna be a nice motherfucking time. Chucky ain't never showed the fuck up. So True Seeker had the accommodations all prepared yes. for everybody to Yeah, True Seeker was, yeah, True Seeker was waiting. Chucky ain't never showed up. And then he lied to True Seeker, told True Seeker, I, I ain't, you know, I ain't want to come. I said, I said, no, that's a lie. I was ready. He lied to True Seeker because I was going to be with True Seeker at the time. But Chucky right. been and lied to True Seeker and told True Seeker I wasn't trying to come. But the whole time, he was the one wasn't trying to come. So basically, it was um, a tip for tat situation. Yeah. Okay. Because Shakima ain't want the nigga. Shakima said, I, I'm going to New York, but I ain't coming to be with no Chucky. I said, well, I'm going to go to be with True Seeker. Mm -hmm. But Chucky fucked that all up, lied to True Seeker. Talking about, oh, yeah, bro, she don't want you and all this shit. Lying like a motherfucker. Because ain't nobody want him. And then the nigga was lying about his dick size. Chucky, three-inch fucking cock-ass, uncircumcised-ass oh, dick. Oh, lying oh, up, oh. Yeah, telling me he got a 10-inch dick and all this shit. Motherfucker sent me a picture of that shit three fucking inches. Lying ass, talking about, yeah, I'm going to fuck the shit out you with my big-ass dick. I can hold it with two hands. Bitch, okay. stop fucking lying. <laughs> okay, uh, a question from the audience. Uh, they would like to know... Uh, Cobain says, um, ask a joking if she thinks Ron can knock Chucky smooth out with one punch. Yeah, Ron can, yeah. Chucky's small. He's skinny and he ain't, Chucky ain't doing shit. So, is, is, is Chucky actually six feet tall? Mm, I would say he about 5'9", five, 5'10". Five, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, but yeah, Ron can, Ron can beat Chucky the fuck up. So, basically, um, this is the, this is the, um, the $64,000 question. Everybody what? wants to know if, and what, this is, this is, this is just me. Um, if Chucky, if, um, if Chucky doxes you or anything like that, are you going to put out his documents? Yeah. I want him to go live. I want him to go live. Put my pictures out, Chucky. And we're going we gonna to get this doxing game going. That's the only thing Chucky got of me. Chucky ain't got no recordings of me. He ain't got shit of me. Only thing Chucky got is my pictures. That's it. Put them out, Chucky. I don't give a fuck. You just going to have more stalkers on me, bitch. That's why Chucky still getting lying. Talking about I'm that, um, my homegirl. Because he know. He put my pictures out. You just going to have more stalkers on me. I don't give a fuck. Put my pussy picture out too, bitch. Shit, maybe so, I get on, a big dick nigga to come through. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Time out, time out. So, you two have compromising pictures of one another? Yeah, I got dick pictures of him. Him butt-ass naked. He got pussy pictures of me. Put them out, Chucky shit. Maybe one of these big dick niggas will hit me the fuck up. Yeah, oh. put the shit out. I don't give a fuck. So, you, you, you got, so you, you got, uh, you, you got rusty dick pictures of him? Yeah, him laying on his ear matches and shit. Fucking skinny, bony-ass motherfucker and his dick all out and shit. Little-ass dick with big-ass balls. Because he don't fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he don't fuck. So he's so going all heavy and shit. You got you, you got pictures you, you got pictures of him on the, on the air mattress. On, yeah, on, the, on the air on mattress. The, I got a recording of him blowing up the fucking air mattress. You got hold on, you bullshit. You, you yes. got no, no, no. When no, he no. first bought it, mayor. When he first bought the air mattress and he was blowing the bitch up, I no, got that no. on tape too. You you got you got his actual face and everything. No, I just got him on tape blowing up the air mattress. You can you, you can blowing up. Yeah. You, you, he on you, tape you, telling me it's an air mattress. Yeah, you can hear him blowing it up. You know them air matches at Walmart, and yeah, they got the yeah. pump with it. Yeah. yeah. Was he blowing? Was, was he blowing up air matches, or was he um using the, the uh, using a machine? Yeah. To blow it up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. See, I thought. See, I thought you said he. I thought you said he was blowing up the air matches. No, you can hear him because I said I said what you blowing up. He said, oh, I just bought an air mattress for now, and I said, oh, you got air mattress because he just came from Walmart. He bought the air mattress. He bought the microwave. The microwave broke the fuck down. So I said, oh, I said, so why you ain't get yourself a bed? He said, oh, I'll get that later. You know, I just need something to sleep on for right now. That's all what? on fucking tape. Well, well, why did he go to um? Well, he just went live. Uh, I don't give a fuck you with live. Right, right. So why did he just um? Why did he go to rent a center or something like that? Because he broke. I even because even when he moved to his one bedroom apartment, he even asked me. He said, "Oh, baby, you gonna help me with the furniture?" I said, "Yeah, I'm gonna help you." I said, "How much the furniture gonna be?" He mm -hmm. said, "Oh, he said, oh, it ain't gonna be that much. Probably like 15. I said, "All right, I'll help you." First, we was gonna get a house together. Right. I said, oh, oh, yeah, oh first, so, so that is true. So, yeah. So I told that you that you was gonna move. You was gonna move down there. So hold on. No, you I move. I was just you know he could have a house, and then you know when I come through, that's where I'll be sleeping at. Cause I told oh. Chucky, I said, Chucky, I said, let's get a house together. You know, I said, let's get like a two, two, three bedroom. I picked mm -hmm. the mayor. I picked out the house, had the owner, everything. Had, had the shit ready, ready. You know, the, the owner was ready and everything. 
you not um not you not you not catfishing me are you? You not going to me? No, no, Chucky is all I got that shit on. I record every fucking conversation me and Chucky do because I don't trust him. He can't be trusted because when he started doing that um intervention shit, lying mm -hmm. and shit, talking about oh, I'm a bad mom. I've been because my sister was like she don't trust him. I know how Chucky is. I know how he plays. Yeah, okay. I had the house every day, nice ass house. Talked to the owner, gave him my information, everything. The owner said, was okay. The, was it on the north side or the south side of um, Houston? No, it's around the um the Galleria. Oh, so uh, so, so the Galleria, if anybody's in Houston area, and you know, Ryan I know, like, know where that is. Ryan yes. that around the Galleria, nice ass fucking apartment. Um, nice ass. It was like a, a like a little slash loft like type of apartment kind of thing. So okay. it was a two bedroom, two baths. Talked to the dude. The dude wanted like um, I think he wanted um fifteen hundred, but he said he'll do thirteen. I said okay. He said I'll do thirteen. You got to pay your own utilities because first he had water included. But mm -hmm. then I said, he said, I'll put it down to 13. You just pay for the wood. I said, okay. Call Chucky. I said, Chucky, I got the apartment. I said, the guy, he only went two months to move in. Told Chucky. Chucky tells him, okay, I'm going to call him. Chucky never called the dude or nothing. And then the next day, Chucky called me to obey. Guess what? I got my apartment. I said, hold okay. the fuck up. I said, we supposed to be um, getting an apartment that I picked. He told me, oh, no, I already got my apartment. So hold on, hold on, hold on. So um, when you were, when you said you was going to go down there and see him. Now, uh -huh. this, this is a strange. Now, this is what's got a lot of people questioning you uh -huh. is, um, the fact that you got kids. Yeah. And no, I wasn't going to go stay with him. I was going Basically, he was going to stay there, you know, permanent. But right. I was going to come back and forth, you know, come like for for two days, go back home, come for, you know. Because so, so when, when I go see him, my kids will be with their father. Okay. So your, so, so your kids, have, have, have your kids ever met Chucky? No. They heard Chucky's voice. My kids okay. said hi to him. They said hi, Mr. Chucky. But no, Chucky never, he got pictures of my kids. I don't give a fuck. Put my kids' pictures out. I don't care. Put them okay, out. Put, put my beautiful kids' pictures out. Put everybody the fuck out. I don't give a fuck. Now, now, what about now, now? What about your 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 older? You have an older daughter. Yeah, I have like, an oldest daughter. Okay. Um, what did you what did you think about when he said um her about um no fuck it up and things like that? How did that make you feel as a parent? You know, especially no, was, this shit, this, uh, yeah, I was disgusted about it, and I even talked to him about that. I said, why would you say something like that? He apologized. He said he was drinking, and you know he apologized for doing that shit. But yeah, Chucky said hi to my daughter one time. Not she wasn't on the phone with him. He heard her in the background, and he said, who that talking? I said that's my daughter because she was going to the bathroom. He right. said, oh. then he said he kept on saying, oh that's our daughter, that's our daughter, and I started laughing. And I said, Chucky, mm -hmm. stop playing. He said, oh, yeah, that's our daughter. I said, okay, whatever, Chucky, whatever you want to say. He said, let me speak to her. So I said, oh, I told my daughter, I said, say hi to him. She said, hi, Mr. Chucky. And he said, oh, she sounds so cute. And ever since then, it kind of creeped me out because he kept on asking about her. He asked me how old she was and shit, and I told him. And he just kept on asking about her. Asking her. I said, you know, I said, why you keep asking about my daughter? She fine. And well, you then, know what they always say. Hold on, but you know what they always, you know, when he said that in, um, yeah. you know, in the drunk man, and, and why he was inebriated, you know what they always say. You know they always say that um, a drunk mm -hmm. man works yeah. is a sober man's thoughts. So you felt so you were you ever going to introduce Chucky to your kids? No, I even told him that because their father don't like. Okay, my husband, he's African and he's Muslim. And one thing mm -hmm. I don't do, I, I'm not going to introduce my kids to no other man. That's 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 the that's the promise me and me and my husband made to each other. My husband said I don't give a fuck who you be in a relationship with, but I don't want so, no man around my kids. So that's so, the respect I gave him. And I told Chucky that. My so husband even so told you, Chucky that. So you are actually legally by contract in the eyes of in the eyes of whatever yeah, I'm married. Company, yeah, you're married. So yeah. um. Do y'all have, is this like an arrangement type of marriage no. or? No, actually my not? husband still want to be with me to this day. My husband mm -hmm. even talked to Chucky on the phone. Right. Chucky right. um, talked to my husband and my husband talked to him and stuff. And my husband mm -hmm. was asking me, you know, this is who the motherfucker you talking to? And Chucky heard him when he said that. And okay. he said, you better not have this motherfucker around my kids. And I told him, I said, no, I'll never do that. That's one thing well, I'll never do. I don't know Chucky. And I told Chucky, for you to be around my kids, it's going to take some time. Like, it's going to take over a year. I don't, you know, we got to really get to know each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But no, okay. mm -mm. the way how Chucky talked, that nigga would never see my fucking kids. Okay. Very interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, I don't oh. know. That motherfucker will never see my motherfucking kid. My daughter's 16. That motherfucker ain't gonna never see my fucking kid. Are you crazy? He be asking about my daughter all the time. And I thought that was kind of weird. I ain't gonna lie. Okay. Gonna lie. Like, I don't give a fuck. Like, let him, let's let get the docs and Chucky. I'm with the shits. I already told you. You a troll. I'm a troll, bitch. Let's get the docs and nigga. Put the pictures out so I can put all the shit out on you. Well, <laughs> as long as, like I said, as long as you don't put nothing out. I guess on the um the kids. Man, I'ma put everything out. I don't give a fuck. Let him put my kids' pictures out. Let him put my pictures out. I'ma put everything out on Chucky. The dick picture, everything, his bony ass motherfucking body. I'ma dock that bitch address. Everything. So whoever wanna pull up on him, um, Betty and y'all, where he live at, ain't nobody gonna take up for Chucky. Y'all can be his ass. He ain't around Garden City. So if y'all really want to pull up on that motherfucker, ain't nobody gonna be there to save him. He ain't got no protection. Mm. That's why the motherfucker. That's why he really don't wanna take it there with me. That's why he only talk that little bullshit. Cause he know I, I put out his motherfucking mom raggedy ass house. No, 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 we not. We fuck out of here. No, I know. Make your if that motherfucker put out my motherfucking kids' picture. All bets is all. His motherfucking raggedy ass mama house going out there. Chucky apartment address and apartment number uh, getting docs. His phone number getting fucking docs. And the Mexican lady you work for her information getting docs. So y'all can call up to her. So the motherfucking bitch ass motherfucker don't get that nigga no more fucking work. And I will call down to the fucking SSI place, bitch. 
and get your ass off of SSI. Play with me if you want to. You want to troll Chucky? I will really troll your ass and fuck up your life. Because you know, without the SSI, you ain't got nowhere to fucking live, bitch. So that's how you, his whole SSI check go to his rent. Keep playing with me. I call, I got all your information, bitch. I will call down there and fucking get your SSI fucking off. And tell them bitches you on drugs and shit and have them fucking do drug tests on your bitch ass. Okay, well you, know, here. well, you know what, then? This, this, this is, um, a lot of people in the chat room are going to ask for, um, where he lives. And, yeah. and they also want, and they also want to know, so what it, I think what it is is this. Everybody's tired of the playing around. Everybody's tired, mm -hmm. everybody, everybody's tired of the bullshit. Um, everybody is tired of the, um, you know, mm -hmm. the, the, the catfishing, yeah. um, the lying. Everybody mm -hmm. wants, everybody wants some facts, evidence, and receipts. Yeah, I'll give y'all his address when he put my picture out. Cause one thing about me. But no, 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 what? no, 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 no. See, that's the thing about it. See, you always gonna say if he does that. You okay, know, like, this is what I'll do. Okay, this if, is what if, I would do. Okay, you know what you do. I would hit. No, no, no. But the no, main no. people that want is Betty and Buddy. That, that's no, 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 no. I'm not asking for Betty. I'm not asking for Buddy. Mm -hmm. You got my email address, the Mayor of Detroit at gmail dot com. Mm -hmm. you know, send send me a piece of something that lets me know that you want to up and up. Just send me something that you know that you want to up and up because um, you know what we hear. Okay, this is what I'll do because I know Betty will find him. This is what I do. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Okay, so this is what I'll do because I know Betty will find them and stuff like that. Hold on. Because I, I got it written down. Hold on. Well, well, audience, um, I hope that you're enjoying the show. Uh, we see that the host of the show is somewhere doing something um, in the background. She's back there in the cup doing her thing. I know she's got to get in the rest because she's got to deal with wheels wheel last night. And if you deal with wheel, you already know that you got to come full tank. You can't come three quarters of a tank, half a tank, um, you know, thing like that. So um, we're not going to do, we're not going to be doing no docks up here. I'm, no, um, no, we're not going to do no docks up here. Uh, we're going to, um, we're going to get stuff, we're going to get stuff like what they say. We're going to get stuff on the back end. Now, we're going to get address. We're going to need something. We're going to need something to put us on the trail. No, 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 no Somebody says once you open this Pandora's box, you can't take it back. Oh no, I'm done with him. Okay. Yeah, I'm done with him. Hold on. I'm trying to um okay. Now I'm gonna just give you a block Chucky live on. Okay. He don't live that far from Garden City Apartments. Actually, he lives on um golf banks right around the corner from Garden City Apartments. He lives in the apartment right across the street from the gas station. So if y'all Google and y'all go around the corner, you know from Garden City Apartments and just go down that block. There's a couple, there's a couple of fucking apartments on that block, but it's one apartment complex that's right across the street from the gas station. That's Chucky apartment complex. And he got a green pickup truck. If y'all go there and if y'all want to, you know, go out there and y'all will see that green pickup truck, that's where he's at. And it's right across the street from the gas station. Okay. Uh, break, breaking news, people. Um, somebody just told Chucky that uh, Chucky just doxed your phone I don't number. give a fuck, fuck that bitch. Right. He doxed my number in his back chat to them fucking people that he don't even know. So it is what it is. And um, hey, 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 and I know you in both chat rooms, but um, the person that's over there is named Candy Cars, LA State. I don't care. Behind fuck her ass. But I did not tell. Now, Jokey, did I tell you to give out your phone number? No, I didn't. You did, right? Yeah, because I'm serious. Okay. And he keep on, Chucky keep on playing with me, bitch. I'm gonna put out the taste next. Think right. I'm playing. Right. Yeah, that's where he at, man. Um, Ryan, the gas station right around the corner from Garden. No, no, no. Not the it's a gas station that's right around the corner from Garden City Apartments. Not that one. You gotta go on golf banks. Somebody said that's the number to Mario's Kate Kaylin. Come on now, no, Chucky. Not, no, that's his number. That's what they're saying. That's no, what they're saying. No, they lying. That's Chucky's number. That's the number that I've been calling Chucky on. That's the new number he just got. When the motherfucker after the motherfuckers robbed him, this is the number. I paid the phone bill to this number. Y'all want it again? Three, four, six. Three nine two, two six six one. That's his number. So, uh, Candy, we know you in both chat rooms. It's not Candy Cartel. It's the other troll, Candy. Um, get your motherfucking facts, evidence, and uh, receipt straight because the mayor did not tell a jokey to give out his phone number. But your bitch That's ass over number. there. But your bitch ass is over there starting some bullshit up. So, Chuck, I know you. Yes, wait, when you when you call it, don't you hear like a man is saying like, mm. don't you hear that on a voicemail? This a motherfucker like they breathing and shit. Jeff, when you call that number, do you hear that on a voicemail? Says nobody's picking up. Yeah, of course he ain't gonna pick up because he online talking shit. Mm, okay. They don't fucking play with me, nigga. Like nigga, I will fuck. Yes, that's him. That's him saying. Uh, yeah, that's that's his number. So I guess you are you having a um. What? Are, are you having a are you having an R Kelly moment? No, I, I'm just I'm waking up. You know. No, 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 I'm, no. I'm talking about when 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 a woman okay. fed up. When a, when, yeah, when, when a woman I, I'm, I'm like Eliana and Carbonation. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, okay. I, I'm, I'm I you know I'm waking up from the demon and all this shit. Okay. 
Fuck that nigga. Chucky, keep fucking talking. I'll destroy you, bitch. Like, don't play with me. I got so much shit on you, it don't make no fucking sense. That way, a motherfucking donator on, over there know where they donations going to. Drugs, bitch. That shit ain't even going to food. You sit around, eat peanuts all fucking day, and smoke motherfucking weed and crack. I thought it was, I, I thought it was almonds. Man, that bitch don't be eating no fucking almonds. He eat fucking peanuts and shit. From that gas station across you from his apartment complex. <laughs> and he get his drugs from um Garden City. That's where he go cop his drugs at. That's why when he came down, and y'all see him, that um that little screenshot um ZX got when he was um you know in his in his truck in Garden City. That's where he get his drugs from. He go there to cop the drugs, but he go back home around the corner on golf banks. Say I'm lying, Chucky. Say I'm lying, bitch. Fuck out of here. You fucking with the right bitch. I, I not always told you, bitch, don't ever cross me, bitch, because I will fuck you up. Fuck out of here. Then your bitch ass, you get so high. Tell, you, tell everybody how you get so fucking high. Your ass always in the hospital at least twice a month. Because your heart beating so fucking fast cause from all the crack and shit you smoke. Tell everybody that too. How your bitch ass always in the hospital two times a month from, from almost overdosing. Fuck out of okay. here. Yeah, every every month, mayor, this motherfucker be in the hospital twice a month from fucking smoking so much crack. Like mm -hmm. the time when he did that little donation drive for my birthday, he got mm -hmm. $700 in donation and give me a dime. Motherfucker but smoked the crack all fucking day, all day, all night. He don't sleep. He don't go to sleep. He be up all day, all night. Then when the money go, and then when he done, then, you know, after his high go down, then he start feeling sick and shit because he don't eat. Then his ass be up in the hospital calling me from the hospital. Oh, uh, babe, I don't feel good. I I'm but, like, Chucky, what's wrong? But oh. is, he, is, he, is he a type 1 diabetic? No, he take insulin. So, he, yeah, he got, he got it real bad. He take insulin. Yeah, so if he take insulin, that I means he type 1, right? Yeah. Yeah, so that's right. Yeah, mm -hmm. he type 1 diabetic then. Yeah. Yeah, that's motherfucker, I, I, motherfucker be working, getting high on the job. Yeah, tell how they be sending your bitch ass home all the time because your bitch ass can't even do the work of your because you weak, bitch. Okay, the other night, the, the other night he was on, um, he did a live and um, he said that he had to be at work. He's gonna be 12 hours, he had to be at work at six in the morning. He lying. That nigga ain't work all this year, mayor. The, the first time he ever worked is when he went to Cali and now he only worked for two days. And the only reason why Chucky stay so, stay so short because, see, okay, the type of temp agency he worked for, they'll have mm -hmm. you go out there, but they'll have somebody looking over everybody. And if that person feels as though that you ain't sit for the job or if you ain't doing the job right, they send your ass back home. And that's what they do to Chucky all the time. He go out to a job site, you know, clean out warehouses. Like last time he was in Beaumont, the bitch was cleaning out Targets and shit. Target, you know, store, Walmarts and all that. That's what he was doing. Hold on, but, but wasn't, that his, wasn't that his father's company that was doing that? No, or? his father don't work for the company he's lying. No, he said his father owns the company. No, his father don't own shit. So, so when he went to, um, what was that? Uh, was that uh, Iowa and all that? That was, that was. Uh, he was cleaning, yeah, he was cleaning. Um, They do like, basically they do like bullshit labor work. Like they clean out warehouses. Um, like you, okay, you know the cornfield and shit. They pick right. shit, you know, just do all right. different type of dumb shit. Manual, manual labor, Ma yeah. manual labor for cheap prices. Yeah, and, they, and basically what they do, they, con they contract it out to the um to the lowest bidder. Yeah, that, and they got a lot of Mexicans that work there. Right, right. So they get under minimum wage. They pay them like five dollars an hour and shit. So why did he go home? So why did he go home so fast when he was out? Because there? they send him home. Because they see that he can't do the work, or they see that he always looking tired and shit. They send him home. Yeah, when he was Damn. in Iowa, they send right. him home. Um, in Iowa. Cause he wasn't doing the work right when he was in Beaumont. They sent that bitch nigga. Well, actually, he stayed for two weeks. They was going to take him to another site, but they didn't pick him. Oh, so basically, what it is is that just some agency picks the people that yeah, they, they pick do a good job. Yeah. Okay. If you do a good job, they'll pick you. Some people they got Mexicans there that don't even go home. They actually basically that's they that's they like they live there. That's they live right out of ho yeah, they live out of hotels. Okay, so while he was um the time that he was in Beaumont, right? Mm -hmm. And the hotel room that he was in. Uh -huh. Was he was he in a hotel room by himself? Or was he in a hotel room no, no, it, it's, it's him and be like three other niggas, and they all be in a hotel room together. Chucky was sleeping on the couch, and two niggas was in the bed. Oh, okay, okay. Very it interesting. Yeah, it ain't no one room to they sell because you know the, the company is paying for this shit. Right, right. So it'd be like three or four niggas to a room. They mm -hmm. got one little refrigerator and they get um they give them um money per day. They really ain't making shit because the, the lady pays them. Basically, the, that tip agency is for like motherfuckers that ain't got nowhere to go. Like motherfuckers that's homeless, they ain't got nowhere to go. You know, they, they work basically to live. They work, to, you know, to get food and live. And okay, they live in uh, hotels. Okay, um, we got um, we, we got a uh, breaking news. We have got another mold. In Ari's chat room, oh, and I'm gonna call and I'm gonna call you out, and I'm gonna call you out, player. And I thought you was real, but come to find out that you a fake ass. And that's um, and I see that you you, you got ghost for a while, but you over there in uh, Chucky's chat room, brother. You gotta realize one thing. See, I see all, and that is the so-called Marine, Steve's, whatever Staff Sergeant Marine. You are over there telling Chucky everything that we saying. So we have we I have confirmed, dude. You are a certified snitch. Mm -hmm. So Steve, I see you over there. Steve, I see you over there telling Chucky everything. Yes, yeah, Steve. Steve, why are you over there telling Chucky everything? It, it, unless that's unless that's a, oh it's the same one because I got the same number talk. Damn, bro, you over there telling them everything, bro. But why you over there telling them everything? Yeah, look at this nigga. So much of a stalker. He got my old picture off of IG as his motherfucker. Something wrong with him? Like this motherfucker literally told me. I said, you know, let's go our own way. He gonna tell me, oh no, I, you know, I'm a troll. You, I'm infatuated with you, nigga. Don't do nobody thing, want you. Do your do your do your thing, Steve. Do your thing, player. It's all good. It's all it's, it's all it's all good, Staff Sergeant. It's all it's all good, Staff Sergeant. Do your thing, Staff Sergeant. 
And he's so fucking dumb. Half of the motherfuckers over in his mind don't even give a fuck about him. They laugh at that nigga a day when he came up. All his fucking minds was laughing at him. The link, the, the, the link is pinned. The link is at the top of the um, the link is at the top of the chat room, Steve. Um, you can see it right here. It's pinned up in the chat room. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Shorty, that's Chucky number, y'all. He live across the street from the gas station on Golf Banks, right around the corner from Garden City apartment. He go cop his drugs at Garden City. So, Steve, why didn't you go? Why, why didn't you go over there and tell Chucky and say Chucky that um I wasn't the one who told the joke to get um to give out um a joke um to give out his phone number? In fact, oh, I, I gave it out. Mary ain't um let yeah, why, 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 I gave out his number. They were talking about damn cologne. Talking about some damn buying this dude some damn three hundred dollars damn cologne called um Creed Events. I know about Creed Events. You gonna pay some money for that? All right, Chucky, better stop playing with Chucky. Don't play with me. I destroy you on here. I'll let your motherfucking donators hear you cop motherfucking drugs. All the fucking the donations you get. And first, let, let's keep it real, real. Bitch, you don't even get donations like that. So when he when, when he gets up here and says that um when he gets up here and says his uh his cash out be banging. He be lying. Cash, no, he got okay. The, the main people that be over here donating him is Boston Strong, me when I was over there in um Sherry Bama, Cole Brunette. They're the only three major donors he got over there. I'm gone, so he only got Boston Strong and Sherry Bama. That's it. Everybody okay. else give him pennies like five dollars here and there. Oh, ain't nobody, ain't, ain't nobody scared of Chucky. Ain't nobody scared of Chucky at all. Chucky's scared of his own stuff. So. Yeah, that's the only main no, two three, big donors he got over here. And that um that Brianna Benson person he got wrenched up, that's that's him. That's not the real Bianca Brianna Benson. Acting like that motherfucker lady giving him five, six hundred dollars. That's Chuck trolling his own check. Yeah. Now now the cat's what, out what, the bag. What, what's the scarier? Um what's, huh? what's the who's the scarier? What you mean? Who's the scarier that phone number that you gave up? Boost Mobile. Okay. Yeah. That's all he got is Boost Mobile. He don't get nobody else. And I even asked, I said, Well, won't you change your carrier? I even told him I put him on my plan. He ain't want to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he got Boost Mobile. But yeah, that's um yeah, that Brianna Benson person, the one that used to um, the one that called CPS on Vic. Mm -hmm. That's Chucky over there. That's not the real her. Okay. They saying that um, he just said that uh, that ZX and called him <laughs> several times. <laughs> yeah, I don't give a fuck about no Chucky nigga. You can't do shit for me. You broke. You a broke ass crackhead. They can't do shit for me, motherfucker. Please, I tried to help you and get you on your fucking feet. Uh, believe it or not, Cobain people still wear Kareem. Kareem is still Kareem is still considered the king right now for a moment. Kareem is still considered the king, but I'm not paying no I'm not paying no three hundred something dollars no damn uh, Kareem. Sorry. I don't give a fuck. Like, fuck out of here. Fuck that nigga. Mm -mm. Don't believe the hype, y'all, about them donations. Don't don't believe the hype. When y'all hear that sound, Chucky got sounds and all type of shit on his fucking phone. Don't believe motherfuckers making his cash app ring like that. Because actually, when his cash app rings, it don't make the dice roll. You know, like the money is dropping. You'll just hear a beep. Okay, so that time that he said that he got, um, that he got 600 something dollars from the cash app. Was that true? From who? 600 dollars from who? With um, with that day that he showed that he had six hundred, he said he got six hundred and sixty-seven. I remember it was like six hundred. Yeah, because that's that, no, that, that was during you know two three days because Boston donated to him, I donated to him, so yeah. Re, you got some. Re, you got somebody in the back chat. Re, you got somebody in the back yeah, chat. That was that was over three days that he got them. That he got them um donations. It wasn't all in one day. Chucky don't get donations like okay, Boston only donates them probably like once, once or twice, you know, once a month. Okay, um, Sherry Bama. Uh, she often always she not consistent with it. Me, I was giving him money like every you know every week, every two weeks and shit like that. I was giving him money when he wasn't even live. Hold on. So what about all these times when um he was talking about that you know that you hit him up for five hundred, you you know you did this, you did that, you made a stash that ring for all this money. Well, yeah, I used to get money. No, I used to get Chucky a lot of money. Yeah, that's no, true. About, I, no, you said you, you said that you used to give him money what once or twice a month, right? No, when I gave Chucky money, yeah, when I gave Chucky money, it wasn't like a little bit of money. Mm -hmm. When yeah, I used to, when I donate, when I gave him money, I would get money. I, well, I would get Chucky money for different things, like okay, mm -hmm. his phone bill, if he needed food, you know, buying him dinner and shit like that, or if he needed his car fixed, you know, if he, you know, if he tell me he needed money for rent and shit like that, I would give him money for different reasons. Like I gave him a thousand dollars just to you know buy underwear and shit like that. I used to buy him. I used to buy him seventy dollars dinners. Steak and all the steak, mashed potatoes yeah, we, and shit yeah, for yeah, seventy. Yeah, that. yeah and, and he took the, he took it and threw it away. No, he ain't throw it away. He ate all that shit. Okay, I, I, I kind of figured that much. I kind of yeah, figured. I that gave much. I gave Chucky money for different reasons. Actually, I was going um, I told him I was going to give him um, I still was going to give him the car. I told Chucky that, but Chucky he ain't got the income to get the car, and he was trying to fuck me out of money then too because he kept on telling me, oh babe, I'm gonna get the car. Just send me the money. Just send me the money. The fuck out of here. I ain't give you no fucking three thousand dollars, and then your ass don't get no fucking car. Just okay. like in the house, he tried to fuck me over with that too. Oh, give me the money. I'm gonna get the house. The whole okay. time he in a one bedroom. Well, we see that we see that Chucky um we see that Chucky's uh live just ended. So that means that the the did you see the number just yeah, yeah the, the number the number just spikes. So that means that you got like, everybody over in Chucky's um, mm -hmm. channel is not over here. So um like I said before that fake ass candy uh you dumb you, you dumb motherfucking uh bitch whatever you want to be called bitch I didn't tell anybody to do anything. If you are gonna give out his shit like I said before, mm -hmm. give out that shit give out that shit in the back end. You ain't gonna put that yeah. shit online. Cobain, you, that... you ain't gonna roast me because the information Chucky ain't going to That's my Chucky see. One thing about Chucky if he had if I was an ugly girl like let's just say if I was an ugly fucked up looking girl he would have been put that out. He's not going to put it out. Because he knows he put, I want him to put it out. Like I said, on here, nigga, put out my motherfucking pictures. Maybe I can have a big dick nigga in my motherfucking DMs. I'm on my Clyde Diva shit. Maybe I have a big dick nigga to fucking hit this pussy from the back and hit this throat from the motherfucking back, bitch. That's why he ain't gonna put this shit out. Cause I'm gonna have one of these big dick niggas up in my motherfucking IG ready to come fuck. Oh wow, okay, that's okay. All right. That's why his ass ain't
Well, you well, you know, you you know that um, if you put your if you know if you put your um information out, you know that you got a lot of people mm -hmm. who gonna put you on blast, who gonna roast you, who gonna do everything. They can't roast me, Mayor. The picture mm -hmm. that he got of me, I got nice ass clothes on. I ain't no cheap ass bitch. Nails done, hair done. And can't nobody roast me. That's why he ain't gonna never put him out. Only way he'll put him out is he think motherfuckers gonna harass me and shit. That's all. I don't care if you put him out. Put him out. Check you put, put my pictures out. Put my sister pictures out. Yeah, put him. Put it all out. Shit. I don't give so, a fuck. So are you are you ready for that? Yes, I'm ready. I've been ready so I can lay these tapes out. This fucking crackheaded ass nigga. Yeah, about you know how he lying. Everybody. I ain't on no drugs, bitch. They gonna hit this shit. Fucking live as a motherfucker. You copping the motherfucking drugs, nigga. Stop the bullshit. And they gonna hear your bitch ass calling me and breathing all hard when you got your ass beat the fuck up. And them niggas whoop your fucking ass, bitch. And you over here acting like you can fight, bitch. They robbed your bitch ass, took your phone and whooped it and beat your ass. Well, that, that the um. The fight that he um he said that he whooped that he whooped two guys. Ass, he lied. Right? That's a lie. Well, that, that, that was that that was the night that he was drunk. He was drunk and driving, right? No, that wasn't that night. It was before then. They beat okay. Chucky ass. Oh, and fucking slammed his fucking leg in the fucking car door. Motherfucking leg was hurting and swollen and shit. And his ass had to go to the fucking hospital. Well, you know what, Chucky? Um, a lot of people a lot of people enjoy you and and they, and they enjoy mm -hmm. the way you carry yourself and everything like that. Mm -hmm. Why don't you have your own channel? I don't know. I was gonna make my own channel. Actually, Chucky told me I better not make a channel. Well, well, maybe you should make your own channel because you you have you have plenty to say about everything and anything and um. Mm -hmm. You, you, you no, I'm thinking about it. I probably would make my own channel. And Brown Square One, let me tell you something. First of all, y'all, you listen to everything Chucky said. That's why I tell people, don't believe what Chucky say. Ask Chucky how many times I told him to go um, FaceTime with me. Ask Chucky how many times I called him and he never picked up the phone when we first started talking. Ask Chucky that. See, you so you so much of a fucking troll. You said they believe everything. Everybody know Chucky is a habitual liar. And I said, that, and I, when we first started talking, I said, Chucky, let's go live on IG. Let's talk to each other. Motherfucker never picked up. If I was so much of a, of a catfish, ask True Seeker, did I call him on motherfucking IG live? Ask True Seeker that. If I'm so much of a catfish, I ain't scared to show my motherfucking face to certain motherfuckers that I trust. If I was so much of a catfish, I would never call a truth seeker. Does he, really have, does, does he really have a gun? What do he really have? Yeah, he got one. Yeah, it's an old gun though. Yeah, it's old though. He was trying to sell the shit. Yeah, because he needed money and he was trying to sell his gun. Actually, I was gonna give him another gun because the gun he got is old. It ain't you know. Oh, okay, okay, but you know what? I think what it, I mm -hmm. think even even though even though you got a lot of people that dislike you, I can actually say that you were actually one of the real ones that that did look out for him. Yeah, um, I was trying to help him. I did everything right. for that man. That did look out for him, but um, but this is the part um, I don't understand. Um. But this is one thing I don't understand. Is, it, is he a convicted felon? Now you, got all the, now you got all you said you got all the information on him. If you said you got all the yes, information, Chucky, yes, Chucky. has been okay. in jail. That's all I'm gonna say. He, he's okay. been locked up. So if, if he's a convicted felon, and we all know, unless unless he's if, if, unless he's been convicted of a violent um, crime, he let me just say this. Yeah, I was about he to say that. Be, oh, yeah. He cannot be in the possession of a firearm. Yeah, I was about to say that. Yeah. So in other words, you're telling us that Chucky is a convicted felon who's been mm -hmm. convicted of a violent crime. So therefore, he should not be. He should not have um, a firearm yeah. in his possession. Yeah, the, the firearm that he got is not registered or anything. But you was going to buy him one. Yeah, I was. I was. Mm -hmm. So that's gonna make you an accessory to the crime if anything he got in trouble with. Because, I know. The, gun was, because the gun was gonna be in your name. No, actually, I asked him. I said, Chucky, I said I was gonna buy your gun, and I told him actually, I was gonna buy out the gun shop, but he was like, No, babe, give me the money, and I'll get the gun myself. Because he really not supposed to have weapons. Wow. Yeah, he was telling me to give him the money. He get the gun. Basically, he was gonna buy it off the street. He wasn't gonna buy, you know, go and show his show his papers and shit. You know, let them know he legit. He can carry a weapon. So he was gonna um he was gonna buy it off the street, but I never gave him the money. I'm like, for what? I I'm trying to buy it for you the legit way. But he's saying, Oh no, just give me the money. I'll get it myself. Everything I try to do for Chucky is always no. Just give me the money, I will do it. I do it. No, nigga, no. You ain't gonna fuck me over. I no fucking money. Fuck out of here. You know, um, I think what the problem is is this. The, the problem is what everybody's seeing mm -hmm. is that um, we have been privy to so many different um, we have been um, privy to so many different lies that we don't mm -hmm. know which one's the truth and uh, which one's a lie. So no, everything I'm saying about Chucky is 100 percent true. He know it's true. Chucky, go ahead, dox me. I want you to. Yeah, I'm a jokey is a woman scorn, and I wanna. I'm ready to destroy this bitch. Sure is. Yo, I'm ready to destroy Chucky. Bitch, you want to play with me? Let's play, bitch. You ugly well, bitch. Well, you know, you, you know what, you, you know one thing, Chucky. You gotta realize this what? one thing. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm, gonna I'm gonna tell you this right now. Um, whoever shoots first is usually the one who wins. Yeah. Just like how um, whoever's first, whoever, whoever's first, the first, the first usually wins, correct? Just like the, you know, just like that. But yeah, Chucky don't got nothing on me. Mm -hmm. Okay, no. What I'm talking about with, as far as um, the bye bitch things like that. Yeah. And, it's, and okay, and everybody mm -hmm. has to know one thing. Bye bitch came out way back in the 70s, 80s. Mm -hmm. And as you do know. And as you do know, by bitch mm -hmm. was used, used by the homosexual, um, you know, the um, homosexual yeah. community. Yeah. So um, it's mm -hmm. best that you let a female come out with it than a male come out with it. Or if you was a male that came out with it, you want you want to be the type to keep on bragging about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, I'm gonna give it to somebody. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give somebody to play on their show. Yeah. I want him. I want him to show my pictures. Go ahead, Dr. Chucky. Chucky, put these recordings out on you. Let's see. Now, if I'm if I'm full of shit, I'm I'm, call, I'm, I'm calling them out. If a jokey so full of shit and a jokey don't got shit on you, Chucky, dox me. Don't dox me in your back chat. Dox me on YouTube. I'm giving you the permission to dox me on YouTube, Chucky. Dox me and my family. And another thing, I did not give Chucky 200 fucking pictures. That's another lie he did. He got pictures of me and my sister. And he got a picture of
I know that for a fact. That's why your bitch ass ain't gonna show shit. The only thing you got is my fucking pictures, bitch. That's the only thing. You so fucking retarded, bitch. You ain't even got my real fucking name. But I got yours, though. I got all your fucking information. You ain't even got my real name, bitch. That's why your ass ain't gonna show shit. Fuck out of you. You think I trust you with my real fucking name, nigga? You out your fucking mind. Well, a jokey, you gotta do this then. Well, you know, it's it's, it's um, mm. it's all it's, it's all out war right now, yeah. right? So, you know, you gotta be the first one to, um, you're going to be the first one to shoot, um, to shoot your shot. You all right, shoot. Shot. I already put out where he lives at, Mayor, and his phone number. Chucky, you put out my pictures, and then I'll put the other shit out I got on you. All the recordings of you, you know, you smoking and shit, falling asleep on the fucking phone, you begging me for money for food and shit, you blowing up your air mattress, even when you was at fucking work, the type of work you fucking do, you keep on going up to the temp agency, begging them for fucking work, and they keep on sending your fucking raggedy ass back home. You going up to that temp agency every fucking day. Yeah, come on, Chucky, let's troll, bitch. Since you talking about something, you a good troll, let's see how good of a troll you is, bitch, or let's see if you fell the fuck off. Put my pictures out. I want you to go back live and put them out. And let's see who the best troll. You ain't got shit on me, motherfucker. I always fucking protect my motherfuckers up, bitch. Fuck wrong with you. You don't got nothing on me, but I got everything on you. And you know I do. Bitch, I even so, have to record you jerking the fuck off. Uh, Keep playing uh, with what, the bitch. What? 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 Yes, yeah, hold on. multiple times. Motherfucker jerking off, calling, talking about, oh, I love you and shit, moaning and shit. Keep playing with me, Chucky. I'll play that too. I'll play that too. You busting nuts on the fucking phone. I you love me. I bet I never leave you and all this shit. You fucking little dick bitch. Hold on, hold on. So, hold on. So, you, you, you got, you got Mr. Yes, moaning yeah, got, like a bitch. You got him busting, you got him busting, busting yes. ladies out? Yeah, coming back to back. Motherfucker so backed up. We on the phone. He want to, he want to fucking, um, fucking, you know, have phone sex and shit. Then after the nigga get done, busting his nut, five, ten minutes later, he want to do it again and do it again and do it again. That's how backed up this nigga is. You big ball ass bitch. He playing, I got that shit on tape too. You moaning and all that shit. All that jokey, I love you, baby. Fuck out of here. Okay, well, you, okay, so you know, you know one thing, you know one thing. Um, if anything else, if anything else, um, people are gonna want to hear the busted open tapes. Yeah, I'm a mayor. I'm, mayor, one thing about Chucky, Chucky already knows, so I already put Chucky address out. Okay, he know I'm not playing with him. Okay, Chucky put out my fucking picture. Y'all gonna hear all that shit. Chucky, I got every recording on him. He, I, we already talked about this shit. I already told Chucky, he even asked me, oh, why would you record me? You gonna put him? I said, you, yes, I will. If you fucking violate me, I will. He already know. So I already, I already shot the first shot because he thought everybody ain't know where the fuck he live at and shit. And everybody ain't know his phone number. Y'all got his phone number. Y'all know where the nigga live at. He got a green pickup. Y'all see a raggedy ass green pickup truck out there? Y'all, that's him. He live right across the street from that gas station. Wow. Um, We got 144 um stalkers and harassers in the... Uh, 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 that's his apartment place. complex. It's a little apartment complex. It's the only apartment complex that's right across the street from the gas station. I'm sorry. We, we got 146 stalkers and harassers out here. Um, We know a lot of you in the bushes. A lot of you are listening and things of that nature. If you are enjoying the show... Please, please, people, go ahead and donate to the host of the show because more than likely the host sounds like she's asleep or something mm -hmm. like that. Um, go ahead and um, donate to RE. Just to let everybody know that you're enjoying the content and enjoying this Saturday afternoon. Go ahead, um, a joke. Yeah, like he need to, yeah, Chucky, let's get it cracking. Let's see who the best fucking troll. And I already told you I was gonna destroy you. I've been told Chucky that. I said, bitch, if you fuck me over, I'm gonna fucking destroy you. And now it's time to destroy Chucky. And let's see if you're doing it. Stay over there. Yeah, I got recorded you talking about a last motherfucker over there. But you over here kissing up their fucking ass. He, so, was even, he was even messy trying to get me and Lacker Black to beef with each other. Does anybody the day. Does, does any of the bots know um RE's um cash app? And if you do know it, could you please put it in the chat room? I will do it, but I know it will kick me off. I, it, it will kick me off the, um, the live stream. So if anybody knows, um, I think it's um dollar sign, Oak Town Girl, something like that. But if anybody knows it, could you please put it in um in the chat room? It'd be greatly appreciated. Yeah, he tried to get yeah. me and Lecker Black the fucking um to fucking you, beat yesterday. Thank, thank you very much, Angie. Appreciate that. So uh, show some show some love, show some love to the host. Holly, ain't hey, no, I'm not living on Sagittarian cold. Yes, the fuck I am. Sagittarius don't back down from nobody. And I'm ready to destroy this fucking crackheaded motherfucker. So yes, I am living on Sagittarius cold. I'm a Sagittarius, and one thing about me, I love you to death. But if you try to fucking cross me, I'm gonna oh, no. fucking destroy this bitch. You a Sagittarius? When's your birthday? December 13th. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna destroy it. Chucky ass. Chucky. My mama's, my mama's a Sagittarius. Uh huh. And go live, Chucky. Go live. Show my motherfucking pick. Don't be in your back chair talking to them hoes back there. They ain't gonna save you, bitch. Don't be back. Yeah, he told me lacquer black messy. He tried to act like oh, oh me talking to triple with something brand new to him. He been new. Fuck he, up. he even told fuck me, fuck yeah, he told me something. Oh, Lacker Black told me you was on the panel talking about me, but then a nigga tried to act like this something new to him. Nigga, get the fuck out of here. After you even said you um that Lacker told you, you still was trying to fucking hook back up with me. And then you you just switching up because you asked me to send you money while your bitch ass was in LA. Told me to send you fifty dollars. I told you no. That's why your bitch ass fucking um mad now because I'm not okay. giving you shit. Oh, okay, you, you know what? Like I said, you you were giving um. Yeah, that's right. Uh, that's right. Do not say triple. Do not say triple. Do not say anything about triple around me. Y'all know how I feel about triple bitch ass. And like I said, I heard and, and I heard when he was over there. Um, with that, but the only thing triple bitch ass is worried about. He, he's always worried about a fucking ranch. That's the only thing his bitch ass is worried about. Mm -hmm. that's, that's that's the only thing about triple. You know, tri triples. Uh, he said, if you're saying that you're not in the sector anymore, but every time you look up, you're in the sector talking about the sector. That's mm -hmm. the problem. That, that's the problem I have with him. So um. No, baby, I'm gonna hit you up. I'm gonna hit you up on IG. Yeah, I'm gonna hit you up. Well, you yeah. need to, you need to hit me up on IG with some of this pertinent information. Shit, like I said, yeah. You know, I, I was debating about who who I'm gonna give it to.
yeah, I gotta fuck it. So all that tough, tough talk shit you be doing with DX, nigga, kill that shit because you scared of him. That's why your ass don't never want to come to North Philly. When you do come to North Philly, you riding around with somebody. Talking about something, you gonna knock somebody out. Bitch, you can't even, your little ass fucking hands, bitch, you crackhead ass motherfucker. You so fucking weak, you don't even eat every fucking day. That's why your ass is on a live today eating peanuts. That's the only fucking thing you can afford, you broke bitch. Fuck out of here. Broke ass motherfucker. Don't like, don't fucking play with me, yo. Well, you know, um, I think that a lot of people are going to, um, a lot of people are going to, a lot, a lot of people in order, I'm joking, in order for people to trust you, mm -hmm. even though that you did give out some pertinent information. No, I'm, I'm, gonna, get, I'm gonna put it out. I'm gonna put it out. No, 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 no. Because you remember, you remember, you said that to me before. Mm -hmm. You said you was gonna send me some things. You never sent me the things that I actually sent me before. I forgot your email address. It's the mayor of Detroit. The way you, the way you see it on my, the way you see it on my avatar. Yeah. The mayor of Detroit at gmail.com. Everybody okay. knows my email address. Okay. I'll yeah. give it to you. Okay. Like I said, I'll, give, I'll give it to you. I'll give it to Betty. You know, okay. I was just debating about who to give it to. Because one thing about me, I'll wait till a motherfucker sneak me first. And I told Chucky, I said, you know, if you sneak me, I'll sneak you. Right, like I said, I'm not gonna like I said, I just want this, I just want this information. I just mm -hmm. want this information for my for my own doing. I don't want to put it out there. I just want my information. Okay. Well, what type of information. information you want? I want everything that you can give me. What, like, okay, I got the records of him. I want I got pictures, I got pictures I want, of him. I want every, I want all. I got his dick picture had. and all that I shit. Want no dick, no, you keep the dick picture. <laughs> I want no dick picture. Go, send, send, send a dick pic to Betty Boop and all that. No, <laughs> no Betty, yeah, send a dick pic to Triple. Triple like dick pics. So send, send, the, send a dick pic to Triple and the Bullets got it. They, they like, they like the dick pic. Uh, no, you keep all that. No, mm -hmm. no. I, I want all, the, I want all the good information. You know, you want, put, you want to have yeah. pictures of my family and another. Uh, I'm not gonna, like, I'm not gonna put you on blast. I'm not gonna put you on mm -hmm. blast, player. I want the information on my own. I, I want the information for my own well-being because see, when I put it out there, yeah. When I put it out there, um, yeah, I'm gonna put you, I'm gonna put you out there, player. I'm gonna put it out there, and I'm gonna put it out there, right? I'm not going, I'm not gonna go half hazardly. I'm gonna put it all out there. Yeah. She can give it to the channel holder, Ali. I don't care. She can give it to the channel holder, but Ali, you gotta realize one thing. Yeah. Um, I, I don't think you, I don't think that she was in here. Um, like I said, but he got pictures of my family. He got pictures of my ex-wife and my kids. And yeah. you think that, and you think I'm gonna let the channel holder have all this personal information? Shit. Yeah, he didn't tell me that because he um sent me a picture of your brother and him and um Trey. Because I even asked, I said, "Who is you?" He was like, "Oh, I can't, I can't give him my um, I can't dox myself." But Chucky know who Trey is. Actually, Chucky told me send me a picture of who Trey was. It's a dark skinned guy. Um, he said they got dreadlocks or something like that. And he's on, he's on, he's on IG. Yeah, Trey. Yeah, he's on yeah. IG. Yeah, he's the one that look up people for um Chucky. Yeah, yeah. Mm hmm And Chucky doxed him to me. Yeah, you right, Salt. You right. Excellent lesson. Never trust anyone on YouTube. You should know that, Salt. Mm -hmm. you, should, you should know that. You should know that, Salt, because some of the shit you done did, some of the you done, you done done some shit too. So let's, let's let's keep it real, bro. Let's keep it real. You done some shit up here too. Yeah, like I ain't got time to be playing with him. Actually, I'll show. Um, hold on. Are you about to put a camera on? Are you about to turn the camera on and show us something? Oh no. Oh, I'm no, I was going. Um, hold on. Cause I let, um, I actually um temporarily took my IG off because I was mad at Chucky. I'm gonna see if I can get it back. Cause I give um Betty his dick picture. That's what she. <laughs> <laughs> him laying in the fucking bed. She can, she can, um, you know, she can put, put that as her thumbnail and shit. Oh, that's not, oh, that, oh that's, uh, that's a fake song. Okay, that's a fake song. Okay, and uh, hot dog slinging uh, floor mopper. I think I've asked enough questions. I don't think he was in here for the whole thing. I've been here asking questions for almost the past two hours. Okay, then, well, whoever you are, um, I'm glad you're here, and I'm glad, you're not, and I hope that you're enjoying the show. And if you are enjoying the show, um, salt seven with a fake salt. Um, make sure that you uh, bless the host of the show by um being entertained. My such as uh, quality work. No, I'm gonna show Betty. I'm gonna show Betty. I'm gonna send Betty his dick picture. Mm -hmm. um, that way she know I ain't bullshitting. I'm just trying to wait and see if he gonna dox me. I got the recordings, but I'm trying to wait and see if he gonna dox me. Hold on, because I've been had his dick. I'm gonna send you one dick picture of him. Okay. Um, question from the audience. They want to know the reason why she lied for Chucky so long. I, just, I said the dick. reason why, because I was protecting him and I was, you know, I, I liked him. I loved him. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna protect him and stuff like that. But I see now he's playing games. So. So you. So th there was a, a, a general type of, um, I want to say, um, admiration for one another. Yeah, we was we was liking each other. We was we was loving each other. Yeah, I didn't care what he looked like. I loved him for him, but he played around too fucking much. So what made so what made you keep what made you keep coming back and keep coming back and keep coming back? Because I loved him. Okay. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie about it. No, no, no. We don't want you to lie because like I said, we didn't heard enough. We didn't heard enough lies. We didn't heard enough lies from the both of you for the longest. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We we don't, you know y'all been y'all been lying so much to us that we can't sometimes know whether it's a lie or whether it's a, whether it's the truth. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But like I said, when um, especially what he and especially what he did to and, and I have a problem with that. Like I said, since so he can do whatever he wants to, is what he did to Miss um, is what he did to Tiny Hicks today. I know he took a wrench, yeah, because he, wrench. he, Cause he, he took, wants he, donations. If you're not donating to him, he's gonna take your wrench and stuff. But this right. the thing: half them women that he got modded up don't donate to him. Right. He just got them over there just to be having them over there. They don't do happy to be nappy. She don't donate. She get Chucky five dollars here and here. Half right. of the motherfuckers over there do not donate to Chucky. Chucky just got them over there modded up so he can fucking talk sexually to them behind the scenes. That's it. Okay. That's all that nigga want to do is talk sexually to him behind the scenes and all type of shit. But yeah, um, Betty, what's your idea? I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna, um, send you his, ding <laughs> his, um, his dingling picture and shit. I think we're gonna want something. I, I think the people gonna want something a little bit more. No, I'm gonna, no, no, Mayor, this, okay. Don't play, I'm don't play with me. Do not no, play no, with no, me. no, no, no. I'm, I'm gonna give it to
I never put out his address or nothing, his phone number or nothing. And he's still quiet because he ain't gonna put my picture out because he don't want me to put them recordings out. Well, I don't want the I, I want I want the information. I, I don't I don't care about anything else. I want the information. Yeah, he ain't gonna put my that's why he on IG now, talking to everybody panicking and shit. <laughs> yeah, he live on IG. Now he not live, but you know he green, so he available on IG. Talking to everybody in the back chat, talking about me. And they probably ask him, do she really got recordings of you? He probably saying yeah and all this shit. So there's somebody that's in his chat room and she's a mod. Um, in fact, it's two, it's two mods, it's two mods that's in there that's always talking shit, especially if I come up on the panel. And one is by the name of Perfect Imp Perfect Imperfection and uh, Sporty Seventh Ward. Are they heavy hitters as far as donating to him goes? No, Sporty don't donate to him. She, well, I don't. Well, I think she donated to him before, but not lately. Actually, Sporty talks shit about him in his own chat. Perfect. He told me Perfect every time she don't, she only give him ten dollars. But she okay. don't, she don't donate all the time. She's not a heavy hitter. The only heavy hitter he got over there right now is Boston and Sherry Bama, and that's Cole Brunette. Okay, go go ahead, Sam Possible. Go ahead. What's your question? I didn't, I didn't read it. I don't. Go ahead. What's your question? Cause I'm too busy, I'm too busy watching this game and uh, what, what's the uh, what's, what's the question saying? So is he still alive right now? Is, is he still alive? No, he off IG. He probably back over here looking. Oh, okay. Yeah. He goes at he, he goes. Why does he go at Vic so hard? Why does he talk about Vic's family and things like that? Because he jealous of Vic. He be saying, "Oh, Vic don't get no donations." This is what he told me about Vic. Vic don't get no donations. Oh, Vic sit. You know, he he sit home all day and fucking um smoke weed. And you know, I feel yeah. He actually tells me he feels sorry for Vic. He, he actually got mad because I donated to Vic. That's why all this shit is happening now. Because he even texted me now. He went live and said, "Oh, he don't care if I donate to Vic." But why yesterday he said, "Oh, well, bitch, you donate to Vic and shit. Stay over there in Vic chat." Why did he go over there and fuck with uh the bottom of uh, YouTube barrel? The, um... I don't know. Oh, Betty, you got it. I sent you a picture. <laughs> his beard, he got that all shaked up, and he laying in the bed with his fucking pants down and shit. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Oh boy. Oh, he's fucking uh, shit. That's why. That's another reason why his ass don't want to pull up on me. Yeah, yes, that's possible. I think. The, I think the love is lost. I think the love is lost and gone and flushed down the toilet and burnt to a crisp and overrides and all that. Ain't no love. That ain't love. That ain't love. I want this on my own. So when I do come out with it, I'm coming out with this on my own channel. Yeah. I want to come out with this on my own channel and um. And I'm sure that Ari, I'm sure that Ari would like, I don't know if Ari would like some of the viable information. Um, so, you know, because she's been um, going at Chucky for the longest. Um, I'm sure that she would like some of this information too. So hit your, you, um, bless your hostess with the mostest, Miss Ari. You know, hit the cash app up. You know, hit the cash app. You know, we don't we don't say that, um, you know, hit it up every, every two minutes and shit. If you enjoying it, go ahead and hit that cash app all the time. Well, um, go ahead, y'all. Okay. That, that is, that, that is a gap. Hey, hold on. Um, a jokey, is that a gap in his tooth or, or is he missing a tooth? I think it's a gap. No, it's a gap. It's a gap. It's a gap. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. Um, so fucking drugs and shit. You see the bags on his fucking eye, Betty. That's where he picture. at. That's where he at. Garden City, copying motherfucking drugs and shit. A, a jokey. A what? jokey. Hit, hit my email up. Send me a picture. Send me a picture of him. Send me a picture of him. Send me a picture. The mayor Detroit at gmail dot com. You got to send me a picture. You can't just send you. You got to send them. You got to send them out to multiple resources so we can make this. So we can make this shit. Um. So we can make this shit definitely confirmed. I got to give me. You got to send me a picture. You got to. You got it, Betty. Okay, I'll send it to you. You got the picture where he got the bags and shit on his fucking eye and that fucking mask on his motherfucking face. And that was when he was at Garden City and he got out his truck. Y'all see his leg when he was on the IG live. He was at Garden City, got out the truck and his fucking skinny ass fucking legs. He called me and camped up and, and took the picture and sent it. Well, actually, he took the picture and sent it to me. Mm -hmm. Ugly ass bitch. This is getting wild. This somebody want to fuck him, his ass look retarded and shit. Fucking okay. white ass tongue and shit. Fuck out of here. Bitch, you ain't going to never fucking touch me. Oh, you don't want, you, you, you don't want that, you don't want that tongue? Fuck, that shit look disgusting. You sure? Hell you no, sure? that shit all caked up on his shit. I even told him to go brush his fucking tongue. Yeah, remember, I heard that, I heard that when, he, when you said that and you started laughing and everything. And they made a, um, no, he's out in, he's out, he's out in Cali, he's back at home. He's back at home, saying he is back in, he is back in Houston. I don't okay. got a fake email. Actually, my guy's just for business. Okay. Fuck no more, fuck him. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't care. Oh, I see that he ain't shit. He do anything for a little bit of money. How you try to fuck over a girl that tried to help you make thousands of dollars, but because you don't want to get your little $700 SSI check cut the fuck off, you you back, you you, you don't want to do it, but now you want to try to lie on me and bash me online. Nigga, get the fuck out of here, yo. Chucky chat, why did you mm -hmm. on me? You know, I've always been you know, very supportive of you. And, and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, you just came banging on me, talking about get me out of this chat, which I don't care about. But I want to know what was the vitriol between me and you, because I didn't have any issues. No, at the time, you okay. At the time, um, you was over there with ZX, and you was talking about Chucky, and I didn't like it. That's why I came to you and said why you was over there talking trash about him. But look, you, Ali, I'm not on that type of stuff no more. Yeah, I was taking up for him at the time. And if I came at you wrong, I apologize for that. Because then you put actually, I got mad because when I seen that he was begging you for money, I asked him about it. 
I didn't even know he was doing that because he told me you was lying. Okay. Uh, and that's, go ahead, go that's, ahead. Why I, that's why I always pull out receipts. I don't yeah. have to laugh anything. All right. And, and, and those are the only oh, that's him. That I, that's so, there, so, so, so. That's true. Right. Okay. So what about the, um, what about the, um, the Billy for Shetty um, um, Amina donations. Was, was, was she cashing him? Was she cashing him out like that? No, she was oh, giving him. Oh, she was giving him a hundred dollars, but she was giving it to him so he could give me half. He wasn't even giving me my half. The first donation she gave him, she told him to give. She said, "Give a joke your half." He didn't even give it to me. So I said, "I left it." That's okay. So then, um, the second one he gave me the half, but this third one he didn't give it to me. All right. Yeah, he didn't give it to me at all. And actually, that picture that is him. That's when he got his haircut. That's when um, I gave him the money to get his haircut and everything. You know, he had a nice haircut. A uh, nice haircut. He got his beard shaped up. That's him. Uh -huh. Yeah. But you're, actually, you're got other pictures. Fun. Yeah. Um. Like, okay. Your 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 pictures and everything that you you know head to toe is pretty much you know snatched everything. What you say? Why is your head to toe snatched? Right. You said in your picture. I never seen your pictures, but I never said I was head to toe snatched. I mean, everybody everybody not perfect. I don't have like no, I'm, I'm not gonna sit up here and say oh I got the perfect hourglass shape. No, I had kids. Like y'all got you hips know, and ass and shit. Shit. No, I'm not, that's not my what? Okay. What you talking right. about? That's not my issue. I'm wondering right. why would you waste your time with Chucky? You know, like, because at first, like, okay, like, okay, okay, I'm, okay. Let me tell you. At first, he lied to me about how he looked. So I was so deep into it with him. So I'm like, okay. And then when I found out the truth, I'm like, I already caught feelings for him. So I just stayed. After I okay. knew how he really looked and shit like that. So I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm already, you know, talking to him. We already, I'm already telling this man I love him. He's telling me he loved me. He was talking about he wanted to marry me and all this shit. He wanted me to have his kids. I was already too deep in the game with him. So I'm like, okay, I might as well stay. And then plus the motherfucker was threatening me if I left him. He was going to fucking come to my house and dox me and all this dumb shit. Mm. So it was almost like extortion or blackmail. Yeah. So that's basically what he was doing. So um, this, is, I, this is what I want to ask you about. Um, why was Chucky so? Why was Chucky so hell bent on going after um, Auntie Miracle about the T-shirts? Yeah. I don't know. I think he was just trolling her and stuff. He seen that she, um, you know, she used his, um, his, you know, his little sling and stuff like that. I think that he was just trolling her at the moment. I don't think he really cared. Okay. Yeah. And and, and another thing, why is it? Why was it so? Um, why did he feel that he had to? Okay, this is all actually. I'm sorry. Now I know what I'm talking about. What was up with you going to the police, filing charges on ZX about the um, about the extortion thing? Oh, I even told Chucky, I said, I can't do anything because uh, Boston is the one that has to, you know, say, yes, this is what happened and things like that. I couldn't do right, nothing. Right, I told Chucky right. that actually, um, Chucky just went live and, you know, he was just trolling at the time. Chucky knew I couldn't do nothing because I told him, I said, I can't do anything. I need a, um, a written statement from Boston to make anything happen. But Boston was going to have to be the one in order to, in yes. order to make it happen. Yeah, because Boston is the one. Go ahead. But, but the thing about it is this. Um, when ZX offered him the money back, it is not considered extortion then. Well, I told, I told Chucky that too. But it, well, with Chucky, you see, Chucky fucked that up anyway because... Chucky went live trolling ZX because I told Chucky, I said, well, Chucky, I can't do nothing. Boston has to be the one that filed the paper and all that. So we already know nothing could have been done. You know, nothing could have been done. But we still went live trolling ZX saying, you know, he gonna get locked up just to scare him a, a little bit. But then the thing I ain't like that Chucky did, we still here talking about ZX is storing Boston, but in the same in the same live, you extorting Boston too. You told Boston, oh, well, you gotta hit my cash at, you know, bitch. If you don't hit my cash at, I'm gonna dox you too. So he extorting Boston also too. That's why I told him, I said, um, Chucky, shut up, be quiet. Cause he just did extortion just like what ZX was doing. But yeah, Chucky knew I couldn't do anything, and Boston knew I couldn't do anything. So is um Boston, so is, is Boston really in fear for his safety? Yeah, it, it, he's scared of Chucky. That man is scared of Chucky. Chucky be threatening him behind the scenes in the back chat, everything. Tell Boston, if you don't give me this, I'm going to dox you. I'm going to straight throw. Chucky even called me and said, Big, guess what? This nigga's stupid. He's scared, of, he's scared for his fucking life. He just some After um after um after Boston's son ZX money, the 170, he gave yeah. Chucky $300. You bullshit. Yes, the same day. Because Chucky told him, all right, ZX ain't put your information out. I'll put it out. You better send me some fucking money. And Boston sent him 300 now, was this on the phone? Was this a phone call? Yes, Chucky called me. I was like, babe, sorry. He was laughing. I said, what you laughing for? He said, guess what? He said, this nigga so fucking scared. He said, this motherfucker just um, sent me $300 in cash here. He said, I don't know what's on his background, but he's scared to have it exposed. And I said, Chucky, I said, y'all need to leave him. I said, why y'all doing that man like that? I said, leave him alone. He said, no, fuck him. If he willing to give up his money, let him give it up. So said, that's is, what Chucky do. Chucky scares Boston. Boston is a nerd. Is, is Boston on a fixed income or does he have a job? No, he got a good paying job. And he, whatever he do, um, it pays him real good because okay. he gives Chucky $300, $400, yeah. So. He uses that. He uses that um to put over his head as far as um yeah. as you give me money. I'm gonna mm -hmm. put all your, um, I'm gonna put all your I'm put all your business out here. Yeah. So, I don't know what Boston told Chucky behind the scenes. You know them chatting. You know privately. Mm -hmm. I believe Boston must have opened up his fucking mouth too much to Chucky. And Chucky knows some shit that don't nobody know. Because I even told Chucky because you actually look on Boston um Instagram. I said Chucky, why Boston got all these women like from like you know websites and shit. So to me, I'm thinking Boston probably talking to women online. You know, camming up and doing some kind of freak shit with him. And Chucky probably knows something about it. Chucky knows some. Chucky's got something on Boston for Boston to donate to him like that. He got something on him. So basically, are you saying that is, is, is Boston a trick? I don't. I'm, that's what I'm thinking. Boston doing something that Chucky know about. Yeah, because see, Chucky tried that same shit with Chusika, but see, Chusika don't give a fuck. He tried the same shit. He knew Chusika information and tried that same shit with Chusika, but Chusika ain't give in, and Chusika just left him alone. But see, mm -hmm. Boston giving in, and Boston is actually scared of him. But the thing is, Boston doesn't even have anything to be scared of him about. No, no that's what I'm what. saying. And, and right. Because 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 Chucky always pump fakes. Come on, when was the last I time? Don't, Ali, let me tell you. 
I don't know what boss. I don't know what. Obviously, Chucky got something on him. Chucky be threatening him in text messages. Like, see, see, what you seen was just a back chat. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about Boston and Chucky talking privately. Wow. Yeah, he got something on Boston. I even told you, I said, damn, why this motherfucker giving you, like, he would get Chucky $300, and then Chucky would threaten him, and then he would roll around and get Chucky another 200 mm -mm. Yeah. And Chucky, I, and I tell Chucky, I said, why you do that to that man? He said, I don't give a fuck. I told him I straight expose him. And he told, and, and Boston actually tell Chucky, oh, I don't want you to, don't put my information out here. Don't dox me, Chucky. Yeah, so Boston tells him, tell Chucky that. So is that, is that the reason why um he made a deal with ZX as far yes. as? Okay. Yeah, and I said he must got a, either a pedophile background or something for him to just, you know, be so scared like that. So, something um, is wrong with his, like something is on his background where he don't want nobody to check. But I think Chucky already checked it and Chucky know what it is. Maybe it's just he doesn't want his job out there because you know how it is on YouTube. As soon as they find him, nobody gonna mess with him. He don't fuck with nobody though. That's the thing I don't get. When he messed up when he first came out, when he first came out um, on the YouTube streets and he came out with his real name. Yeah, exactly. Unless that's you got something, if you, if you don't got nothing to hide, then you come out with your real name. But he came out with his real yeah. name mm -hmm. and, now, and now that everybody has something on him. Yep. Yeah, but yeah, um, Chucky blackmailing that man. Man, Boston get paid, his whole check go to Chucky. And that's sad. And that's yeah. sad. I done and watched you, him. And so I don't feel, you know, sorry for his, you know. You I don't know, feel sorry for him. I don't feel sorry for Boston. Yeah. I, I mean, like, why would you give somebody your whole paycheck? Yeah. You might as well just lose your fucking job and get unemployment. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? I remember one time he gave me 300 I thought he was playing. Because he was like, no, no, Joe, I'm going to give you I said, stop playing on me, boss. He gave me $300. He, he said, he your birthday or something, right? No, it wasn't for my birthday. He just oh. gave it to me. Then he, no, he gave he Chucky. Chucky that he got yeah, he, he got gave Chucky 600 Gave Chucky six hundred dollars. This when he got paid it was on his pay. They gave Chucky six hundred dollars. Gave me three. I thought Boston was playing. I said shit. I said Chucky actually gave it to me. First he gave me two fifty, and then he sent me fifty dollars. Chucky got mad because Boston gave me three hundred and cussed Boston ass out. I mean, cussed Boston out. Told Boston if he ever sent me money again, he was going dox. Yeah, said he was going to expose Boston. And then that morning, Chucky, Chucky, the six hundred dollars was gone. Chucky done smoked that shit up. Then Chucky mm -hmm. called me in the morning, threatening me, telling me to send him half of the fucking money. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, you know, and, and I got I got more shit, but but I'm you know, I ain't gonna put it out there unless a nigga bite. Unless a motherfucker keep putting my motherfucking name in their motherfucking mouth, mm -hmm. then I'm straight expose you for the motherfucking bitch ass nigga that you are. Period. Point blank. Yep, that's why I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I got so much shit on Chucky yo. I got him talking about a motherfucking mod over there. I got him on fucking tape, copping drugs, all type of shit. Now, I got a lot of, of shit on him. I joke it. Is one of the pictures that you sent Betty Boop? He has on a gray hoodie. What yes, a, what that's a, Chucky. One, one is when he strung out on the shit, and the other one, the one him laying in the bed. That's when he just moved in his apartment. I got his hair. That's when I gave him the um the stack. He got his hair cut, everything. Got his, you know, his beard shaped up. Him up. You yeah, him I saw him. Yeah, I saw him. I saw him a thousand dollars. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, you did say you did say that. You, you sent him to get a yeah, haircut by, by underwear and all that, mm -hmm. you know, all that other stuff. Yeah, that's him oh. on the airbed and all that shit. That's he blew up the airbed. That's when he wanted me to talk nasty and dirty to him because he wanted to jerk the fuck off. He don't get no pussy. Don't nobody fuck him. Yeah, do not. Don't nobody fuck him. That's like he was telling anybody he was in Beaumont and, and, the, and the, the um the Puerto Rican girls and shit raped him. That was a whole lie. They can't even touch the girl. Ain't no girls be there. And the girls that be there, it be women that be with their husband. Because like, like I told you, Mayor, it's people that act, they, that's basically they like, they, they hotel hop yeah. and they work for the company. So right. they whole family be there. The, I mean, the wife, the child, everything. They, they go buy food, all that shit, because they stay there for a while. And that's where they live. Okay. So if y'all heard women in the background, that'd be the, the, um, the men and wives in the background that goes with them because they ain't got nowhere to go. Um, before I, before I get off of here, let me let me let me tell you how the play is gonna go, right? Mm -hmm. The play is gonna go. Um, there, there's a few of, of, of little Chuckies running around. They're gonna be like, "Oh, Ali said this about you. Mm -hmm. She said this about you. She said this about you." Because they want to instigate shit because they want to see the receipts. Now, um, hopefully Chucky is in here. He in here. He listening. Yeah, and hopefully he sees that. You don't want you don't you don't want nobody interjecting themselves into the bullshit because it will mm -hmm. get chaotic. So so, yeah. so trust your gut. Trust your gut, Chucky. Okay, trust your gut. Mm -hmm. and don't that's Chucky no when he strung out on that shit. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's him when he struggled. I see the bags all under his fucking eye. He, that's when he was at Garden City when he went live on um on IG and he was at Garden City. Y'all see his little raggedy ass fucking leg get out his fucking truck and he was walking around. That's the same headphone he had when he had that white shit around the motherfucking mic. Yeah, that's him. And that's when he struck out on that shit. You see the bags and shit all under his eyes. Hmm. Wow. Yeah, that's who, him. Who those pictures. Are you? Are you? No, I sent. No, I sent. I sent the picture. Oh wow. Okay. Um, but but I mean that, that's gonna be the play tomorrow or maybe later on today. So so watch it because I, I am a very analytical person. So I see the future before it even happens. Mm -hmm. Okay. I know. And they're gonna I'm do the same right thing too. I, I know. You right now. You better, you better you better make your you better make your best shot. You better make your first shot your best shot, uh Joseph, I'm telling you right now. Oh, I'm ready for this nigga. Exactly. No, I'm no, I'm talking about I'm, I'm talking about if you got if you already mm -hmm. got the ammunition, if you already got your sight set now that you better yeah. try firing right now and so I went back. Oh, no, I'm I'm not, oh trust me, man, I got this. Okay, well, I, oh, trust you, me, well, I, I know Chuck like the back of my motherfucking hand. Well, but you Chucky gonna say what's gonna happen with me, Chucky gonna stay quiet. Chucky well, ain't gonna do shit. Only thing well, Chucky man. gonna do is dox me in his back chat. That's the only thing he gonna do. Well, he ain't no, gonna no, go like live that. and dox me. I need that. I, I need I that. I, I need that. I need that. I need that like a crack at it. I mm -hmm. need that. So don't play. Don't play with me. I'm gonna need that. Let me say it. I don't have no. I know. I so if no he think idea. I'm playing, so if Chucky right. think I'm playing, happy to be that. Go back and tell him. If
And I got some ammunition for that, but I, 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 uh-huh. I'm going to stay quiet. I'm going to stay let's, quiet. Let's see if fucking Sherry Bama get him $50, $200 when she know her $200 going to fucking crack and motherfucking weed and pill. This nigga said they spent all his donation on crack, weed, and fucking pill and don't even buy no fucking food. He said home, hungry and shit because he said he had smoke all day and then his, his fucking stomach touching his fucking back the next day. Hmm. Like, Chuck, you don't fucking play with me. You said that you call me. Oh, baby, I'm hungry. Fuck out of here. And you said they spent all your fucking money up. Yeah, mm-hmm. tell everybody how you said you over there talking about Jazzy refrigerator empty, bitch. Your shit empty too. So that is, is that an efficiency that he's living in? Yeah, it's like a, like an efficiency one bedroom. Yeah, everything is, oh. is is in the opening. Oh, that's a studio. Then. Well, actually, no, no, no. He got, he got his own bedroom. He got his bedroom, and then he got a little, a little living room in his kitchen. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let's see, Chucky. Yeah, I put your shit out there too. How you bathe me, or baby, I'm hungry. Buy me something to eat. How your fucking smoke crack all fucking day, and your ass end up in a fucking hospital because your heart beating so fucking fast, a bitch. Yeah, I got tapes of your ass in a fucking hospital getting checked the fuck out, and it, this shit happened. It's a pattern oh. with him. Twice okay. a month, this motherfucker be in the hospital from almost overdosing. Don't play with, don't play with, don't play with me, Joe. Do not play with me. I'm no, for real. no, I'm saying don't play with me as far as sending me some of this information. You ain't gotta send it up to me all, but I'm gonna need some of this information. I'm gonna need some no, of this information. Gonna, no, trust me, uh, trust me. I got all y'all. You, if Re want a piece of it, Chucky. Uh, see, one thing about Chucky, I, I study him, so I, I know how he play. Send a dick, he, he's send, send, send a dick pic, send a dick pic to Triple and Gotti. They like those. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, and happy to be nappy. You can take your fake trolling ass somewhere too, you fake ass bitch. You talk about Chucky like a dog too, bitch. You was over here with Buddy talking about Chucky like a dog, but now because you know you can't be over here with Buddy no more, now you want to go back to Chucky. Get to y'all some fake ass bitches. Hold on, you, hold on, hold on. Happy to be nappy. Hold on, Joey. Did you? We, we never. You didn't say that. Um, Boston was a uh, pedo, did you? I sure did call him that because I'm like, what the fuck you so scared about? I said, well, Chucky must got a pedophile background. Oh. Because why okay. a motherfucker so scared and giving a man all that fucking money so he won't put his information out, knowing that um. Um, that information just got exposed about him fucking around with people and shit. So well, I, I must remember well, um, what time? Yeah. yeah, I remember that. Yeah, that Wu fucked around when he get, when uh they found out his real email address and um uh-huh. his name out there. That's what he fucked up at right there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, happy to have you fake ass bitch. You another broke ass bitch. Yeah, tell everybody how you was in a fucking back chat job searching and shit. You broke ass hoe. Mm. Tell everybody, oh yeah, I'm, I need a job. I'm looking for a job. All y'all bitches, every fucking bitch that was in that bed chat, if y'all fucking come at me, I will put all y'all shit out. Don't fucking play with me. Because you another broke ass hoe. You just over here with Chuck because your ass ain't got no fucking money to donate to him. You only get a nigga five dollars here and there. So bitch, you best to stay. Look, listen, lady, let me let me go after Chucky. Because if you if you think you're gonna talk your shit to me, bitch, I'll put out the shit he say about you too. A so your best bet is to leave me the fuck alone. A, a jokey, can you confirm one what? thing for me? What? You know, with this whole back chat thing. Mm-hmm. Have I ever have you ever seen my name type in their no, back? You never type, no. Ever. No, you never typed. Okay, that, that's, yeah. that's, that's, that's one I thing I can say about you. When, when he put me back there, I never seen you engage with them and nothing, nothing like that. I don't, I don't do shit like that. Uh-uh. Yeah, I don't. You know, Joki, a Joki, you know it's this much right now. What? Um, that's one thing as far as a black man goes. Mm-hmm. When you sit up here and you call somebody um, a pedophile, and that right yeah, there. Yeah, man, I believe I was right because the motherfucker uh, made up with me the next day. Who's that? Boston. Yeah, the next day the motherfucker was kissing my ass. Okay. If he was so see. mad about me calling him a pedo, why the fuck when I told him I was gonna hit him up on IG, he was fucking begging me to hit him up on IG. So well, obviously something wrong with his background. Some, some, something like I said, you know, um, this, this whole Boston thing, and the simple fact that when he got up here and said that um, when um, ZX and uh, Chucky was going about it as far as his um, extortion thing, when Chucky came out and said um, mm-hmm. instead of him going after instead of him going after ZX as far as taking up um, taking up for Boston mm-hmm. because he's a person that's in his chat room, he said I'm he said, I'm going after ZX because Boston is one of my heaviest donators. He's the one who puts a roof over my head and put on my table and clothes on my back. Uh-huh. So that right there to me that was fucked up right there because if, if he um if you have his back, then why does he have to donate in order for you to have his back? Oh, you talking about Boston? Yeah. Well, only thing I know about Boston and Chucky's situation, Boston must, uh, like I said before, something must be on his background he don't want nobody to find out about. And that's mm-hmm. why he gave Chucky all that fucking money. Well, yeah. Happy, you right, happy to be happy. That, uh, that, that don't give a quick. fuck. Boston is a fucking troll. He pays, let me say this. Boston pays Chucky to go after people. Let's just put that out there. That, okay. He that's pays what, that's people. What yes. Actually, that's Boston pays Chucky to go after me. To go after you? I thought you yes. were cool. No, that, that's the game he playing, Mayor. Boston pays Chucky to go after people. Why you think Chucky always, when Chucky be had my name in his title and going after me and Boston be in his chat cheering him on? Because that's what Boston paid for. Just like Boston paid Chucky to go after ZX. Right. Okay. Okay. So give me, miss me with that bullshit, happy to be that. Bitch, you used to be in the back chat. You know how this shit go, bitch. Stop fucking playing. So when we find, so when we find out, nobody's going to donate to you for harassing me back. Chucky, you in the wrong chat room, player. You in the wrong <laughs> chat room. Chucky, <laughs> Chucky, Chucky you in the wrong Huh? I don't even think that's him. Oh. His Chucky is in lowercase. So somebody's trolling. That's not the Chucky. So, that's not the real one. Oh, so that's yeah. a fake one. Yeah, that's a fake one. And plus, yeah, okay. this picture not that dark. Exactly. Yeah. So, so in other words, Boston has been paying Chucky. Yes, the attack to go, people. To attack people. Yeah. Okay. They be over there in his chat like he ain't doing shit, like he innocent and shit. Man, get the fuck out of here. Wow. Chucky, you know what the fuck he be doing? 
Yeah, Boston, Boston be the big chat. Oh, I do. We supposed to be ZX intensive. Why are we talking about me? Because that's what. Because he paid Chucky to attack ZX. But see, Chuck, Chucky don't be you know directly attacking ZX. He will wait until um ZX say something about him. But Boston be so fucking mad because he paid Chucky to go after ZX. So Boston, so so Boston really did donate to Chucky um nine hundred fifty dollars. Well, the nine hundred it was from the three hundred from me. He gave me three and gave Chucky six. That's what he talking about. So no, but it's more, but it's more than that. It's, yeah, he gave Chucky way more than that over the time he been over there. Yeah. Right. That's what I'm saying. So it's, it's, it's more than it's, it's more than that. So it has to be more than that. Yeah. Yeah. It's more, yeah. It's way more than that. Yeah. I remember okay. Boston first came back over there. He because I was like, who is this? He was like, oh, Jokey, you know me. And he gave me his real name. And I said, oh, okay, I know who you is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And happy to be happy, girl. Shut the fuck up, cause you troll too, bitch. This how fucked up Chucky is. This fucking fake ass fucking bitch. That's not her in the avatar. This fake ass hoe. This fake ass hoe. Sit up there, troll me and Chucky chat and told Chucky her troll name and Chucky allowed this bitch to do it. Fuck out of here. Bitch, I will fucking girl. Leave me alone, bitch. For I fucking make you look dumb about all this shit Chucky talk about you. How he call you broke and you ain't got shit. So your so, best bet is to shut the fuck up and watch the show. So why did he why did he do the things that he did to um Miss Pinky and uh and Tanya Hicks today? Because they don't donate to him. They don't donate to him. Happy to be nappy don't even donate even only why he keep her around because she trolled me. That's why he keeps her around because she because she go under her troll page and she trolls me. But um Fifi and Tanya don't donate. That's why he kicked them out. Okay. Some women over there that's mine, he used them for his dirty work. It ain't, it ain't all about donations with some of them. Like this whole ass bitch in the chat, he used her to do his dirty work. Yeah. Just yeah. like he was so messy, he tried to get me and Lacker Black to be with each other, telling me, oh yeah, Lacker told me you was over there in triple chat talking shit about me. But then when I said, okay, so Lacker told you that, okay, I said, when triple go live again, I'm gonna call her out and ask her. Then the nigga got all scared and shit, talking about, oh, I ain't never telling you nothing else again. Wow. He messy shit. Yeah, he messy. He tried to. That's why when y'all think I just be um beefing with motherfuckers, just attacking people over here. It, it, it's not like that. Chucky be putting shit in my ear, telling me, oh, this person said this, this person said that. So I'm like, okay, you know, I'm believing him. So when he go live, that's when I call the motherfucker out. And, and lo and behold, it ain't that, because he's lying. Mm -hmm. And also, um, some people, they were asking, oh, well, why did Allie put out, you know, her private conversation with Chucky? Um, I was going to keep that conversation private, first of all. And second of all, before I did it, it was when he started calling me bitches and hoes, uh -huh. talking about me like I was um no child of God uh -huh. and, and acting all fucking crazy and all that shit. I don't know if it was for show or whatever, but you don't do that to somebody that you always beg for fucking monetary gains for. You don't do that bullshit. Okay. I'm not your co-host. I'm not your co-host. I'm, I'm not none of that bullshit. I don't get paid to be, you know, and, and this ain't no dick to you, Jokey. I'm just saying for myself. Yeah. I, I don't get paid to be demeaned or anything like that. The fuck? So that's when I was just like, you know, I wasn't even going to put that out. I wasn't even going to tell people about that. I wasn't going to put it in my community tab. But this uh -huh. is the way that you treat me. After me keeping your little secret that, that you always call me when you're broke or when you want some money or when you want to want to be fraudulent or scam the fuck? Not yeah, that's all he do. Yeah, that's all he do. He scam motherfuckers. He hit people up um on the back end, asking them for money. He asked me for money every day. This motherfucker asked me for money yesterday, and I ain't give it to him. Oh, no, that's why he went yesterday. live today. Yes, this motherfucker asked me to send him money yesterday. That's why he went live this morning. Hold on, I thought y'all, I thought you, I thought y'all went y'all separate ways. No, we did. But the reason, okay, so when he was in Cali. You know, right. we started back talking again. You know, we was talking or whatever. Then while we talking, he asked me for money. I said, Chucky, I said, I said, we just started back talking. Why you asking me for money? Oh, fuck that. You know, you, you don't love me. You don't want to send me no money, but you donate the fucking Vic and ZX. So I said, okay, I said, you know what? This ain't no love. I said, if this what if this how this relationship is gonna be, we might as well just walk away from each other. Then the motherfucker texts me back, oh, tell me you love me and all this shit. Then he called me while he was in Cali and Cali and said he was coming home the next day and we gonna talk. So he come home, we talking, motherfucker asked me for money again. I ain't give it to him. That's why he went live this morning, because I didn't give him no fucking money. So you know what this you two definitely are a love and hip hop. Fix my life, Ayana. Uh, Dr. Phil, Oprah. Ah, no, uh, I told him, let's walk away. I said, if this gonna be about money, you go your way, I go my way. We wasn't, we wasn't together together. We were just talking back to each other. We wasn't, you know, getting back together. But you, while we talking, you know people, he asked for money. Well, you know, a, a lot of people are going to look at you as an accomplice for Chucky um, because you was condoning him. You was, you was condoning him um, hurting other people. So you, oh, you, yeah, you that's see, true, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. You, yeah. you see what I'm saying? A lot of people are gonna look at you as an accomplice yeah. because you was out here doing things. Just like, you know, just like, um, I, guess I can make myself accountable for the fact that um, I was in this chat room when you know when we did when we mm -hmm. did certain things to certain people. Yeah. So so you understand? No, I, 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 yeah, I, I, will, I will own up to that. When he when he was talking shit about people, I used to you know have his back and shit, engage in right. this shit. Yeah, right. I'll, I'll I'll own up to that. Yeah. Because okay. I almost felt like when when he would call me like you know for money or whatever, and also my husband was present, you know, during this time mm -hmm. too. So well, he can tell you about it as well. But the thing is, I almost felt like maybe a joke. He's like telling him like. Oh no, he he texted me Ali and said, "Oh Ali playing games." Before I even said something to you, he texted me and said, "Ali playing games." I said, "Why?" Because the only thing I told him, I said, "Well, Ali over here was ZX and ZX talking shit about you." He said, "Well, she owed me money anyway." I said, "How she owed you money?" Oh, I wrenched her up and she told me she was gonna hit my cash at. I said, "Well, yeah. I said, well, she ain't give the money. Take the rent from her." So well, he he, for life, I, I paid for a lifetime reach over there and he said he yeah. gave me <laughs> That's how that started. He said, oh, she told me she was going to give me money. She was going to hit my cash out for the rent. I said, well, Chuck, if she ain't hit it, take the wrench. That's how that popped off when you when you got up there. And when I got up there and I started cussing you out and stuff, it's mm -hmm. because he knew what I was going to do. Mm -hmm. And he tried
He tell right. me, oh, this girl just like Lacker. He said, oh, Lacker told me you was doing this because he thought I was going to go after Lacker Black. And I told him, I said, you know what? I said, she got that. So I'm not even going to go after her. Because mm -hmm. he thought I was going to attack her. No, you not. Because I already seen what the fuck he was trying to do. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, I want to address something. Um, Shreebad, I don't know if your comment is positive or negative or whatever, but you said, you know, a lot of people got Ali looking like Flip Flopper Supreme or whatever. And the thing is, the people that I've been kicking it with, <laughs> day one, w when a person gets mad at them, I don't get mad at them and, and, and flip on somebody else. That's a flip flopper. I don't yeah. do that. I stick with you. So, so if I was, if I was in maybe, for example, ZX's chat, just because him and Chucky got a spark, uh, a squirrel or whatever, I'm not just gonna be like, okay, fuck you, ZX or whatever, or fuck you, Chucky. I don't do shit like that. If, if you haven't fucked over me, if you haven't did shit to me, there's no reason for me to not just continue to do what the fuck I've been doing since day one. You can't find one person that I've ever done that to on YouTube in my YouTube history. I don't just go over to people and be like, oh, this person did me wrong, so I'm gonna hop to their enemies. I don't fuck with people's enemies. If, if I wasn't fucking with you before, yeah. I fuck with you now. I give it time. Yeah, I give it time and let it build up. Yeah. I don't fuck with you, period. Just because you got something going on. Now, now there's people that I have sat in their bushes or whatever like that, you know, due to my alliance with somebody, but I didn't hate them or anything like that. I didn't hate them or I didn't like, you know, just bring some bones over that nobody knew about. The fuck? Mm -hmm. So stop with that flip flopping shit because I've never been a flip flopper since I've been on YouTube. If I like RE today, guess what? When she has an issue with somebody else, that, that's their issue. That ain't got shit to do with me. Yeah. No, Cobain, the only reason why we was blocking you because he tells us to block you. When you write stuff in his comments that he don't like, he would say, block him. So that's the only reason why I was blocking you and other people was blocking you. But everybody, let me say, everybody's not with um, Chucky. You know, they, they want to be down with a click and shit like that. So they, you know, they they following what he telling them to do. Just like, like you, you got to understand this. Everybody on this motherfucking clout chasing. Whoever is the hottest motherfucker at the time, that's where they want to be. Like, when Buddy are getting hot, we're happy to be happy. We was that bitch. You was over here with Buddy, right? Now Buddy, he on some other shit. He, told, he ain't talking about Chucky like that no more. Now your bitch ass back over to Chucky. Well, it's it's like it's like this. It's like the same thing I told him when I went over to his chat room, and even though he said I'm blocked, I still can't type over yeah. there. Um, he tried to keep the shit up with um with me in a uh, DVT, and I'm telling him I'm like, bro, me and her decided to go our own ways. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying I'm not saying shit about her. She's not saying she's saying shit about me. She's saying shit about me, and um, yeah. I, you know, I, I really don't care. But when you get up there and you told her on your panel, until I face DVT, you know this, this, that, and other. So that's right yeah. there that tells me that you want to keep you want to keep shit going on between mm -hmm. me and DVT. And I'm yeah. like, dude, I, you know I already told you I don't argue with women. I'm not gonna keep on arguing with women. That's not that's not mm -hmm. my deal. But you know that's just how it is. But I, I guess right now what we're seeing is that. We are going to yeah. want to see. We, we're going to want to see. Like I said, we're going to see something that is going to take you out of being considered a liar or or, or a gaslighter or a catfisher. Mm -hmm. You know, um, we're going to um, we, we're going to have to see something from you or yeah. see something that you give somebody else. Trust me, Mayor. This ain't trust me. I know Chucky like the back of my hand. I don't mm -hmm. put out his picture and his dick picture. Oh, he gonna go live about me again. Trust me, y'all. Y'all go ahead and record. Just wait, wait. He gonna dox me. Just trust me. See, this is what he's doing right now. He got Trey trying to look me up and shit because he really ain't got shit on me. Only thing he got is my pictures and shit. He ain't got no real fucked up shit about me that he can talk about. So what he's doing right now, he got Trey looking for shit on me, which you ain't gonna find shit. That's why his ass ain't go live yet. That's the thing, you know, like yeah. if, you, if you get doxxed or whatever, you know, as long as you're not in a situation that they can harass and call and call yeah. HR on you, then you ain't got mm -hmm. shit to worry about. It, yeah, I don't care. I just, I'm just waiting. One thing about me, I'm just waiting for him to put my pictures out. Soon when he put them pictures out, trust me, Betty, you will be the first motherfucker that got the recordings. Because I even told him to leave Betty alone. I even told, I even told him, I said, you know, me and Betty made up. We said we wasn't gonna talk about each other. He got mad about that. Cause he want me, he want me and Betty to be going back and forth. Right. Man, okay. and don't nobody got time to be going back and forth with nobody. Yeah. Damn. Like I'm the type of person if, if I if, if we fall out or whatever, you know, and, mm -hmm. I, and I'm gonna bring this person up because because I see a flip flopper up in the motherfucking chat. So mm -hmm. and I don't say their name, but when me and Clyde Diva fall out, it's just like oh Ellie's so bad, Ellie's so bad. But me and them ain't never had a falling out mm -hmm. or had anything to do with each other that was negative. Yeah. But oh, and that's a motherfucking flip flopper. The fuck? That's a flip flopper. I don't do shit yeah. like I don't do shit like that. Yeah. You, you, you know, what, to be never, I don't know what picture he's showing you. I ain't got buck teeth, so I don't know what the fuck he over here showing you. Well, Ajoki, yeah, you I know, don't have buck teeth. I joke, you know one thing. Yeah. You know one thing. If you go, if, if you go back over there. Oh no, I'm done with him. There, mm -mm. You know I wasn't even with him yesterday. No, I'm just saying, if you go back over there, do you know mm -hmm. anything that you say from now on? Oh yeah, I know. I ain't going back to him. I'm done with him. I'm good. Okay. Mm -mm. okay. Yeah, this, this is the last final straw. That yeah. motherfucker. Uh uh. But you know what? But you know what? I can, but no, don't let me say that. You know, you are free. You are free to go anywhere you want to. No, don't let exactly. me say that. You are free exactly. to go. You're free to go in any chat room. You're free to go anywhere you want to. to talk to you um when you want to. Don't let me put that on you. You can do whatever you want to. You're a grown ass woman. Live on responsible for your own actions. Oh no, I'm good. And I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you guys something too. I'm gonna, tell, I'm gonna tell you guys something. I'm, I'm one of the ones, one of the ones, I'm not gonna say I took credit for all of it, that pioneered that shit. I can go anywhere the fuck I wanna go. Whether it's, it's you, even if it's your fucking ops, as long as I'm not fucking talking about you or, or, you know, or participating in a chat that is demeaning you or not taking up for you or something like that, I can do whatever the fuck I want to do. All right. and get shit to do with me. I go wherever the fuck I wanna go. Well, that's, that's the whole thing about yeah. it. That's just the whole thing about person, it, Ali. Yeah, just because a person kicked you out of their chat don't mean I need to be kicked out of their chat. If I'm enjoying the content and I'm participating in whatever topic of discussion it is, because sometimes I, I, I don't like
that's period point blank. I come in very calm, demeanor, positive attitude, ready to like, okay, like, let's chop it up. Let's have some conversations. I participate in your chat, whether I participate, whether I subscribe, whether I hit the like button, whether I donate, nigga, I am supporting your platform. Mm -hmm. That's period point blank. And a lot of black people don't fucking do that to this day. The fuck? And you got the nerve to say something about me? Bitch, get the fuck out of my motherfucking face. Mm -hmm. Well, Brown Square One, look, you ain't, look, I don't give a fuck who don't like me, okay? You can't look, lady, I don't care. You always been a fucking troll from day one. So keep trolling. I don't that wasn't about you, Mark Hunt, by the way. You wanted to. Yeah. <laughs> like I said before, Chucky know I know how Chucky play. So Chucky, you, you got the next move. Put my pictures out there. Yeah, put my picture. Put my real pictures out there. Don't put no fake picture, bitch. Put my real picture out there. Hey, yo, Jokey, let me know when you're coming over there because I got a couple questions for you, all right? Is that cool? Who this? This is Stefan. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll come over here. All hey, right. Okay. Ari. Mm-hmm. Allie. Hey. Mayor. What's up, Stefan? <laughs> All right, I'm going back over there. Okay. All right, I'll try to come over there too. Um, but Cobain, I, I still, I still like Shitty Greg. I mean, there's nothing wrong with Shitty Gang. I like all of you. Well, not not necessarily all of y'all mm -hmm. because I saw all of y'all trying to sneak this, and, and y'all know if, yeah. if y'all see me with Clyde, I don't like that sneak dish and shit. I like to be direct. That's why I came up on this motherfucking platform to talk to a jokey. Yeah. And to hear it that out. to me that first of all, let me let me tell you this. You so fucking dumb, retard. That's why, I, yo, Chucky, please put my pictures out so I can put the recording out. You gonna look real dumb. You over here trolling for Chucky? Troll on, cause that's what you gotta do. You know, to keep your wrench. Cause you don't donate. You broke hoe. Yeah, she's so it fucking is true. dumb. It is true. Because the woman is is she's over, you know, overcoming the, the, the birth of the child and she needs rest and she needs relaxation. So, you know, I mean it's different in different cultures, but that is yeah. true in different cultures. They help you. Oh, All right, make it. the first move, Mayor. He just gotta make the second move. That's it. Chucky, no, 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 trust no, me, no, no. Mayor. Trust me. Chucky mm -hmm. ain't gonna go out like no bitch ass nigga. He trust me, he's doing his little research his research right now, trying to look me up, trying to find more info about me. Trust me, that's what he's doing. Y'all gonna see my pictures today. And when y'all see my pictures, that's when he fucking record is gonna drop. I ain't scared of shit. And I already told Chucky that I'm waiting for this fucking bitch. Cause he put pictures out of my fucking friend and lied to ZX. I was like, oh yeah, that is her. Nigga, one thing about me, I ain't hiding from nobody, okay? Okay, yeah, I'll be on YouTube. Everybody don't need to be in my life. That's why I don't care for motherfuckers, for motherfuckers like Chucky and motherfuckers like fucking Happy to be nappy. Because see, see, one thing I hate about a, a jealous ass hoe, cause they think, okay, oh, she can't be insecure. See, that's how you know Brown Square One and Happy to be nappy, y'all some jealous ass insecure bitches. Because if Chucky do put my pictures out and he say, oh, this is jokey, y'all the same hating ass hoe be saying, oh, that ain't her, that ain't her. Cause y'all want a bitch to be ugly. Before he even knew I was recording him, he been knew that I was recording him, cause I told him I don't trust him. Fuck out of here. I ain't got nothing to lie about. If I was so scared of Chucky, I wouldn't say shit. If I was so scared of Chucky, I wouldn't say shit. I keep my motherfucking mouth shut and just walk away. I ain't scared of that bitch. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Like, mm -mm. And you got you got yeah. motherfucking protectors like Brown Square and fucking Heavy. These, these are the bitches that protect Chucky. Yeah, they protect him. WWJD means shit. That's gonna be yeah. we 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 Jordan's and drink. That's exactly that's exactly what they're gonna do. I used to hear cash, grass, or ass back in the day. You can't get a ride with me unless you give me cash, grass, or ass. That's real. Quit playing with us. Oh my god. <laughs> We don't want the good stuff, nah. We don't want the good stuff. You take the good stuff and put that up. We're gonna take that and put that. We're gonna take that and put that up. That's what we're gonna do. In the recordings. Yeah. Okay. 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 Well, like I said before, folks, don't don't play with don't don't play with me. Um, make sure that you um send me that information. I am. Make sure you send that. Um, with that being said, mm -hmm. um, ladies and gentlemen, um, I'm about to step down and let um Ali and Ari take the rest of this. Thank I appreciate you. you. Too. Okay. Yeah, um, I was going to do that too. Right. Mm -hmm. Salute, so, Mary. Salute, 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 to, salute to the chat room for those who like me, for those who don't like me. Um, you know, I'm glad that y'all stay stuck around and got some of this good um some of this good hot um some of this good hot tea, but um. We're looking for a host with the most to come back and take over her show and um, call it a wrap. But um, other than that, um, I'm up out of here. Peace. Peace, peace.